All right, it's the last time through the this Mo Miss Monique special. The last time. For those that, you're, if you're watching this offline, hey, thank you so much for watching this. We're about to get started with another stream. Today, I'm going to be researching memory in JavaScript. I think it's going to be pretty good. I want to play around with uh, just how high-level me you know, memory management works, okay? So, it's going to be a good stream. It's going to be a good stream. I can feel it. It's going to be a goodie, okay? I think it's going to be a goodie. Hey, pop it out. Hey, Pan hey, Panda Coder, how you doing, buddy? Weird, it won't let me make this bigger. Oh, hey. How you doing? Limosh. Hey, yo. Yo, baby. Yo, baby, how you doing? Yo, baby, how you doing? Hi. 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 How you doing? You guys doing good? We cone today. We cone today. Made me get into coding at the age of 30. Well, let's go. Uh, what's up, Prime? Hey, T-Net. Thank you very Welcome much for that. Costco. Delicious. I love Twitch Prime, six months. You know I appreciate that. That's commitment. Get head eyes. Dude. I still can't believe we were playing a game yesterday. So for those that don't know, I got to play a little bit of a video game for a moment yesterday. And I kid you not, Cam, frequenter of the stream, Co joins the lobby with Tarkov, accidentally quits, kills himself. Pick, who also doesn't play Tarkov at all, tries to loot his body, shoots his body, alerts everybody where we are. Within five seconds, we're dead. First game, nothing. I love I3 the way it is, yeah. Welcome to I, Costco. I, I, I am not, I'm clearly you. not a gamer. I'm clearly not a gamer. It's obvious, not a gamer. Not a gamer. Thank you, Pedro Dominic. Dominigus. A perf stream. Let's go. Already love it. Yeah, Apex Legends. Yeah, I'd much rather do a Legends stream than this. You know what I mean? Ooh, you know what we got to jump on Twitter? We got to jump on that Twitter, baby. It turns all your bad feelings into good Big feelings. Big Sir Holy Pie. Ooh, let's, let's just say... It's a night. Let's try something a little different on this one. Welcome to Costco. You got to make your alerts all a little you. bit different. Because or else people get, you know... They get a little squirrely. How the markers are broken. I, but I figured out why. Because I unlist my VODs. Apparently, it's impossible to mark a VOD when you're unlisted. Yeah. Yeah. Measuring your greatness in Tarkov is like measuring your programming skills by the knowledge of assembler. Measuring your greatness in Tarkov is like measuring your greatness in how many times you can get punched in the dick before you rage quit. For me, four times. Pick is the best at Tarkov. This is fact. Stop monitoring me. I'm going to monitor stay hard, stay hard and soft. Dude, I forgot to shave today. Look at how big this beard is. I got to get this off. Oh, what did he say? Ooh, what did you say? My poop stinks. Yeah, no, nah, no, nah, you don't, uh, Bertrand, you don't even have to get him. You, you can just get him out for this. Okay, hold on. Let's, let's see what he has to say. Does this guy contribute at all? to anything to do here. Okay, so he he's, he has said officially nothing other than my poop stinks. Is this all we got today? Is this all we got? You know what? Get him out. Get him out completely. If that's how you're coming in, you're going out. Okay? You come in this way, you go out that way. Everybody knows it. Everybody. Yeah. Yeah, it just walks in. Starts talking about his duty. Never even mentions his name. A uh, hello. Nice to see you. Your mustache looks nice. Instead, just goes straight for what comes out of both his mouth and his ass. And I, I don't want to talk. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to see it. I don't want to hear about it. I don't want to talk about it. Get him out. Get you him can feel the calm before the storm has the round don't want none of this. It's a fact of life. It's a fact of life. Are you copying Dr. Disrespect or is Dr. Disrespect copying you? I think we're just similar people in the sense that we're just people who Welcome fully to embrace who we are with all aspects of our life. I didn't add this, okay? Somebody else added this, okay? Someone else threw that. How do I donate money? Uh, why are you no answer? You just, Welcome to you literally just texted me. You. Don't even try that. Okay, you didn't just text me. Uh, I don't answer text messages. I literally have not looked at anything. What? Uh, uh, this next weekend. Wait. No, this weekend. Like, Saturday and Sunday. Like, Saturday and Sunday. 
You name the day, I'll be there. I also got to pass it with, uh, you know, my wife and all that. Bonjour. Uh, Kev Jumbo, thank you very much for that. I appreciate it. Olinder, uh, you've been a great inter inspiration for me. Started watching more than a year ago. Got kick uh, from it to commit uh, more to learning and was able to get a job in November last year as a Java dev. I know, the Java. Ew. Uh, still, love uh, love the insides into, into tech and the amazing vibe of the stream. Keep it up, Tokyo. Hell yeah, brother. Uh, really? Uh, so three days from now, either day works for me. Nice, 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 nice. I gotta, I gotta like... Text my wife and make sure I understand that. Happy VS Code Day, I guess. Uh, VS Code Day is fake and it's stupid. Okay. Sorry. If you have to have a, if you have to have a day for your editor, your editor sucks. Uh, I just watched your latest YouTube video. Have you? Uh, you have to define errors in Rust, and that's a great point. Uh, pro point. However. Uh, is it the same in uh, handling exceptions in Java? In Java, you also define your own exceptions and handle the errors like that, similar in Rust. So it's different. Rust, you cannot throw. You can only return it one level. I have nothing going on this weekend, but Friday night, I uh, so I'm open for any time. Okay, nice. I only have something going on on Friday night. What the F did I just walk into, and why are my hips moving? I was told it's because they don't lie. They don't lie. And welcome. You're, you're, you're welcomed here. Okay, thank you. Uh, let's make Fortnite in Rust, uh, guys. A uh, Fortnite is the true Web3. <laughs> yep. Hey, but I'm just wondering, uh, do you have any task management tools? No. Rust has officially been implemented in the Windows curve. I saw that. That's pretty exciting. Help. Uh, I am interning at this company, and they don't know any kind of, uh, and they don't use any kind of uh, visual code, v VS code. V v what? I'm confused at what you're trying to say. Yes, and it's very important. When writing library code, you can't just throw an exception and hope for the best. Exactly. So in Rust, you can define your own errors. Use a crate called anyhow or this error, and then you can return the error. Uh, strings are also implement the error uh, trait, so it's just like they work. Right? A lot of easy stuff. Oh, version control system. Oh. Ew. Dude, if you, don't, if you work at a company that doesn't have virtual control system, you just have to understand that whatever you're doing is going to be hard and dangerous. Real talk. It's virtually impossible. That's all there is to it. it what, you, what you're doing is, just, is, is, is extremely impossible. Best drive. It is. I like subversion. So try catch, on the other hand, the reason why try catch sucks is that you don't have to handle the error. That's what I mean by that. Is result string string bad? I don't think so. I think you can do that. But real talk, you don't have to. You don't have to handle the error. Your function can just ignore it, and it can be tossed to the next one. How do you use VC, uh, VCS a database? Wait, what? I don't even know what you're trying to say. Is he coding? Welcome to Thor Nef Wait, what? I love you. Your sentence is not even a sentence. Zip it and ship it, baby. What are your thoughts on switching from dual boot uh, to WSL for uh, web dev? Uh, yeah, I don't dual boot. I just use Linux for, for web dev and non-web dev. I don't understand what the point of Windows is on a, on a dev machine. I have a separate machine for gaming and gaming-related activities. Welcome to Costco. You work at Netflix, I by the way? You. By the way, I work at Netflix. Hey, Brock Hard, I'm also hard. I heard all the Spanish quit Netflix because they char they put a charge on uh, on password sharing. Just all the Spanish. Just every last Spaniard on earth. Including, but not limited to, Maximus. All quit. Relith. If error does not equal nil is the way. I, I do like that. Bye-bye, Spanish. Bye, Spanish. Uh, Brockhart, Tokyo, Tokyo. How, how do I stop watching ads by paying? Uh, you have to get a sub. Tier one, my friend. Get a tier one sub and you're fine. Uh, Chris, uh, Chris Cacked. Chris Cacked. Chris Cacked. What's the difference between copy and clone? Uh, clone you explicitly call, copy you do not. When you pass your object to a function explicitly, it copies it. So references are copy. If you take a reference to an object and pass that reference to a function, it actually copies the reference. A reference is, I mean, you can think of it as like a, a word-sized number, right? Wrong window. How does the password uh, thing work? I, I, I don't know. Maximus D's nuts. Yeah, that's right. Is programming just a feeling like you're getting in uh, only realize, uh, you know, nothing in a cycle? Sort of. You start to realize larger and larger concepts. Miss Chinchulines. Uh, day seven of programming every day for 100 days. God, I can't wait to be on the back end portions. Yeah. 
Uh, of course, Welcome yeah, 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 yeah. I moved to Hello. a new job today, and I was the uh, let's see, it was my first day, and unable to Welcome choose, to Costco. Or, and, and was Hello unable you. to close 14 features on uh, your board. Am I a senior developer? Yes, feeling. you are. It's you are. Nice. Hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa! That guy, prospect. Thank you for that. Brand new. Brand new. Hey, Ham Samish, you most certainly have already followed me or subbed to me once before, okay? Ham Samish, I don't know what's going on here. R. Bazara, thank you very much for that Twitch Prime. Let's go. Uh, and Brockhart back in again. Feeling it out with a gifted sub. Thank you. Reference is a hexadecimal number. It's not a hexadecimal number. It's just a number. There's... Hexadecimal is a choice in how you represent something. It's just a number. A number, a base 2 number Welcome is a base 10 number, which is a base 16 number. They're all the same thing. They just look different. Welcome Duncan the developer. Well, how do you do? How you. you doing, buddy? I appreciate that, Duncan the developer. Uh, and Bad Bull. It turns on your what up, Bad Bull? Thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime. Thank you for the brand new Tier it's 1. Thank you for the brand new Welcome Gifted to 1 of the Dev Cactus. And thank you, Kamexuluani Camel. I'm going to call you Camille. Hey, Camille, thank you very much. Pancake Spaceman, appreciate that. Thoughtless Labs, let's go. Let's go, baby. Would you use uh, Diesel or Squeal X for a project? Neither. Terso Tech. That's what I'd use. So think about that one next time. You come in here with your, your, your Diesel. Okay. You come in here with your diesel. Diesel's not a, you know, and this thing, here's the deal is, 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 is this thing is just a raw squeal client. So if you wanted to make an ORM, you could, I bet you diesel, there's a way to make diesel work with this. You know what I mean? So you could use diesel on top of Tercel. Uh, do you think you could, uh, it's better to get into machine learning since there is a high probability that web dev will be replaced with AI? Uh, this is a statement that's too, that's too unreal to even consider. I mean that. I mean that in the most genuine way. You don't know. Oh my goodness, that guy prospect, you just got done subscribing and you followed like a minute and a half later. That, my friend. Okay, that, my friend. That's commitment. Thank you, Poopy Diaper Kid, for the follow. Also appreciate that. Look at this. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? There you go. Look at that. Came in right there. Later on, came in right there. That's commitment, my friends. Coding for Netflix. Can you uh, stream work-related projects now? Neither. It's research, baby. So I signed up for Terso, but uh, decide. But I don't. I don't know what that word is. What is detardard? Detardard. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Treated or regarded with contempt. Wait, what? This is not a stupid question. Yeah, of course you can do any of these things. I assume the CLI allows you to do these things. I know you can you can shell into a database. Hey, coding at C coming in two months, tier three. Can we all get claps? Tier three, get out of our mind. It I know that's what I thought. I thought this man was just jumping in with some word that I'm not allowed to look at. It turns out it's a it's a word. No, it's not a word. Oh, that's not a word. It just re it just respelled it for me. I was like, wait, what? To I didn't even look at this. I just I assumed you. it was the word. I was like, ah, uh, no, I don't know what that is. No, it's not. It's not. Yeah, that's just the hard word. Don't be a dummy. Don't don't be a dummy. Okay, let's not do that. Look at that. I'm so I I know dyslexia for the win, dude. I got dyslex. I got I got them dyslexia so bad. Regarded. Ah, it's regarded. I got Lixdexia. Oh, you hell yeah, I'm Lixdexian. What is Fermion? It's how I feel after an afternoon. Uh, why SSR? Why not? Okay, we're moving away from Slack. Uh, anyone have a tool to DL all my DMs? Uh, lots of knowledge in them. Oh man, that sucks. Dude, that sucks. You literally, people, you, you're, you're moving away from it. Where are we at? Okay, we're at a 1,000 people. Feeling firm, people. We're feeling firm. I think it's about time to go. What are we researching today? Memory. All right. Welcome to Costco. I love you. All right, so I have this, I have this idea. 
Okay, so le le let me tell you something. Okay, I'm struggling with something. Are you guys ready? All right, so let's let's actually let's let's talk about this question. Let's actually start the stream now. We're 13 minutes into it. Let's start the gosh darn stream. Snarkapus, thank you for that delicious uh, Twitch Prime. And why do people like using Planet Scale for selling all this BS? It's just terrible. K8s is the way. I think some people just don't want to manage that stuff. You know what I mean? I I think that Edge and Serverless. This is a great kind of like middle ground for like a very small shop where people don't want to manage servers, right? To me, this seems like a very reasonable thing. Uh, howdy, aim. How you doing? K8's me, Daddy. Did you know that Easy E did tell you about K8's at one point? I can't find it anymore. He did for uh, he did he did it for uh, cameo. It was great. Uh, watched every single George Hotz video on the internet last night. He's the smartest man in the world, also the dumbest. <laughs> Damn, waiting for 420. Pog, I know. For, I know. Remember when we used to wait for 420? That was that was just a year ago, or that was just like four months ago. All right, are you ready to do that? Okay. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready for this? Okay, so let's let's give like a little introduction. Are you ready for the introduction? Uh, first, I'm going to go like this. Hey, this is a marker. So that way, when we upload this to YouTube, we can cut off everything before this, you know, because we don't need that in here. Okay. All right. Uh, so what are we going to do today? Welcome today to is going to be a magical day. You where we are going to go through and kind of play around with some memory and how it exists in JavaScript. And then we're going to test this by creating a couple different uh, kind of items. Because right now there's something that I'm really stuck on at Netflix in which I have a service that when something uh, when something happens, when, a, uh, when people make requests to it, it will end up using a gigabyte of memory. And it just tanks the service regularly. And so I'm trying to figure out how to avoid Welcome this. To and so today we're going to do a bit of research and try to figure out, hey, how do we reduce memory? Is it possible to reduce memory? Because right now I keep destroying my service over and over and over and over again. I can't have one request take a gigabyte because I, I if, if it could just take 500 megs, I could survive. But a gigabyte is just too much. Space complexity. We're having a space complexity problem, a very unusual problem here. I'm saying no thanks to... Yeah, so, so that would probably be the easiest, would be to use a different language. Unfortunately, the entire ecosystem at Netflix, you really only have Java or JavaScript. Apparently, someone heard they're the same thing, so we have both of them. That's what we have available. And I don't want to use either. I think Go would have actually been probably the best choice because it is the next most supported uh, language. But after that, there is a Rust sort of support, but I kept having these problems with how it's interacting with our security service. And I kept making requests, and the request would just... Oh, out! Thank you, Lithium. The request would just stall out, and I was unable to keep on making requests, and so it would halt the service. So I can't use that. So I, I, I don't have time to debug what the hell's going on between security and hyper, right? And so I'm just going to be purely working inside the bounds I have to try to overcome this issue, right? Because when I did it with Rust, I was able to reduce the memory to 25% that of original. So we're talking about uh, from 200 megs to 50 megs. It was pretty great. <laughs> Pastest guns in the West, hell yeah. Bawada, thank you very much. Peppo, yes. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Okay, Fortnite lover, you don't have to keep cheering bits. If I read it, I will read it. I'm trying. Okay, language support doesn't matter. I made a suite of AWS SDKs uh, for Rust, and they are perfect. It took me uh, no time. Okay, slow down. Uh, in before uh, PrimeGen leaks Netflix keys. Well, that's the good thing, is I'm not doing it on my computer with Netflix. I'm going to do the research and set up something to kind of fake it. Fake it till you make it. You know what I mean? Fake it till you make it. Uh, came across your videos on YouTube recently. Hands down the most entertaining. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, oh, I appreciate that. Welcome to Costco. Hey, hello. Hey, howdy. I love you. The tap tap man. Well, thank you. Leak it. The hair is fake. The hair is not fake. It's rich. It's luxurious. Ugh. Okay, do you see that? That's not for you. Fake because he's not uh, just uh, he, he's just not that good in bed. Okay, calm down. Papa! <laughs> Thank you very much. All right, so let's get started. Thank you very much. I appreciate. It. What conditioner do you use? Uh, I don't use conditioner. Trick question. Don't use conditioner. Do you like that? I appreciate that though. Uh, no receding hairline here. Yeah. Uh, if you had to choose C plus plus or Rust, Rust. If I had to. Uh, fun feature in PHP, uh, with reflections that you can parameter with a specified, uh, oh my goodness, I can't even read it. Okay, I think it's going away. Specified type, or you can automatically call coerce in the URL and code. Wait, what? Wedgie Gamer, thank you for the brand new tier one. Let's go. You. All right, so here. 
Do you have a bald spot? Looks, I mean, it's pretty good. I'm sure, I, I'm sure, I'm thinning out for sure, right? My hair's not that luxurious pile it used to be. You know, I am 36, or 37 almost. So, we're going to get there. Like, there's going to come a point where I'm not going to have as much hair. You know what I mean? Right? It's just, I, I'm going to, I'm going to be 37 here in a couple months. So, it's like, how am I doing? I'm doing good, I think. I think I'm doing good, okay? I got a jawline still, okay? I got a beautiful mustache. I haven't shaved in a while, so the jawline's gone. But that's good enough for me, you know? That's all I can ask for in life is that I, I feel young, uh, feeling good. I can make babies, and I can program on Twitch. You know what I mean? Theo collab went. Me and Theo have done some collabs before. Gray is propagating. Yeah, I do have some gray. I don't care about gray. Gray, let the gray come in. In that order, absolutely make babies. What? Well, I can't make babies anymore. Okay, I got I got surgically unable to. For those that don't know, snip. But you know what? The good news is I can always take a practice test. Por qué Maria? Por qué Maria? All right, are you ready for this? Thank you, Fortnite. Again. All right. So we were doing this last time. We were doing some some rust. Let's go to personal. Let's make dirt. Let's go like this. We'll just call it Netflix. Why not Netflix? Uh, let's do a little yard. Why not yard? Why, do I have PNPM? No, NPM. Uh, Anit, yes. All right. Thank you, baby. What'd you do? Kiefer? Yeah, it's not bad. I, I, I can get down with the kefir. All right, let's get going, boys. This is what we're going to do. It's going to be very, very simple. Are you ready to do this? Are you ready to do this? Okay, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to jump in here. We're going to get out the source package. Okay, boys. Okay, boys and girls. All right, and we're going to have ourselves a little data server, okay? And we're going to put this bad boy into TS because why the hell not, right? And so get that eval out of there. Uh, import H HTTP from, yes, give it to me. But I don't like e Elon Trash. What? <laughs> What? I didn't I didn't do that, I swear. Wait. Um uh NPM I give him the D boys, give him the D's. Uh there we go. There we go. Get one of those. Do one of these. Okay, cool. HTTP dot create server. Let's go. And then we have to do some sort of what? Listen? Yeah, let's go. Uh, 420, 6, 420, 69. There we go. All right, so this is looking good. So now that we have this, what we're going to do is we're going to be feeding this live. We're, we're going to make, when you make a request, it's going to feed back a lot of objects here, okay? Any chance you give us, noobs, a little uh, rundown of what we're doing? I already gave it. We're going to create memory, and we're going to find out ways to be efficient with it. Okay, so this is what I'm going to have. I'm going to have a type event, which is going to have, say, a message type. This is literally how it is in my system right, uh, right now. We're using Go as the back end so guess what we have that it should be that but it's that i mean really it should be this because we're awesome but it's not it's it's that other thing so i'm gonna go like this type string me daddy and then i want a bunch of fields what kind of fields are we gonna get let's go like this um let's go type uh export let's export that son of a export that let's go in here and let's have types ts let's just do that add that thing yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, XF, yep, make that happen. There we go. All right, cool. Uh, let's go up here, make that, post that in here. And so let's just start creating basic events. I don't care what this thing call is called, right? Event one. Let's make this type uh, event one. There we go. Bam, bam, bam. And I'm just going to add some fields, right? No chat stack. Shame. Firm on. More like more firm. Okay, here we go. Um, at a com today, we are exploring memory usage and storage and uh, GC uh, cycles, right? So this is real. I want to explore some pretty important stuff today. And so I, I really want to understand the garbage collection. And I think that this is going to be a really cool thing. And so if you don't catch all this, I'm going to try to make this into like a five to 10 minute video in uh, 
on my main YouTube channel. JS, what is memory? It's actually really important. People don't realize that this is one of the most important concepts. In fact, it's such a good important concept that uh, there's this challenge right here. I always go like this. I always start off with Tailwind. You always start, oh, did, did I just see Ty Lopez? Hell, oh, hell yeah, Ty Lopez. Knowledge. Look at him, he's reading books. Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah, brother. Read that books. Uh, okay, Tailwind. Uh, go to Tailwind. Books. Book reader average. Okay, so this guy right here, creator of Tailwind, also referred to as the most loved and the most hated man on the internet. CSS diehards hate him. Tailwinders love him. I, I, I think of, uh, I, I tend to put Tailwind haters in the same category as uh, Elon haters because their jokes are just mediocre. I feel like you could do a lot better jokes with Elon then, you know, then typical, typical ones are like, you billionaire cock, right? You're like, you could do better. Let's, let's get some good jokes. Tailwind, it's always like, Tailwind, that's what farts are. <laughs> it's like, dude, come up with some better material, okay? Come up with some better material, people. If you're going to insult somebody, at least, like, think about it. You know what I mean? At least come up with something. Love you, bro. Right? Like, you gotta, you gotta be smarter than that. I just hate really lame. Uh, I hate really lame, like, ripping on people. Yeah, well, yeah, well, he, he sucks. So anyways, I told him I will solve this on stream. So I, I am the person that I think this is, I can solve this on stream. He's going to send me a spec plus a test harness, and I'm going to show, I'm going to show him how to doogie, which, of course, the big thing is going to be don't use memory. I'm going to win. I'm going to win this game. Someone said yesterday on Trash's stream that a stream is a type of stream to watch while Prime's not on. <coughs> That's a huge compliment. I mean, for, for Trash to be able to receive second place is probably the highest place he's ever received in his lifetime. Okay? So I don't think you should be, like, begging on him like that, okay? Hey, that's, a, that's, that's really incredible. You know, I think you should clip this and you, someone should post this on Twitter. I will then re retweet it, okay? Anyways, all right, so, anywho, so let's get back after this. So, we're going to create an event. I don't really care what these things are called, right? You know, uh, it's going to be a series of metrics, right? Met uh, metric, I don't know. I don't really care. It's a number. Uh, it's a number. Uh, I don't know how to do this. I know there's a way to, to use incrementing of letters. I just don't know how to do that. Uh, e, uh, F, let's go uh, G... H I okay, that's pretty good. Let's get another one of these. Uh, let's go like that. Let's go one, two. Give them the old one, two, baby. Uh, what should we do here? Actually, I don't want to do that. Let's go H I J K L M N. I hate typing the alphabet N O P Q R S. T. You is there? There has to be a way to do this uh, really easily. You know, I should have used a number. Why didn't I use a number, people? Why didn't I just use a number? Real talk. Why didn't I just jump in here and go like this? Hit him with the zero. Jump in here. Put it right here. Give him the old G A A. Bam, bam. Okay. Why? Why didn't I just do that? That seems so much nicer. Right. Uh. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let's record a macro. Paste. Bam. Oh, damn. That didn't work out at all. <laughs> I didn't record that macro. Okay. Yank. Paste. Increment. Delete it. Up one. Apparently replay that. Damn it. This macro sucks. Okay. You know what I'm just going to do? I'm just going to go like that. I tried to be all fancy, and it turns out I can't even be fancy. You know what I mean? All right. So there we go. Let's only have a couple metrics on this one, right? There we go. We'll add one more. We'll add one more. Uh, in fact, we'll, we'll add one more. And this one will be our big one, right? Yeah, yeah, this will be our big one. 
Yeah, yeah. All right, there we go. So we got, we got, we got them. We got a lot of metrics here. Okay, we got a lot of metrics. Uh, will you explore different run times? No, absolutely worthless for me. Uh, even when he fails, it's still impressive. Hell yeah, hell yeah, brother. What's GAA, good sir? You don't know GAA? Every man should have a working knowledge of GAA. Thank you for the hearts. Um, here, I'll, I'll, I'll give it to you, okay? I'll give it to you good. Uh, here we go. I'm going to do this just for you, Sarthak. You know why? Because you've been kind to me, okay? So I'm going to go like this. I'm going to hit you with the screen key. I'm going to delete that one. Here you go. That's what I'm going to be pressing. So let's go like this. I'm going to go... I'm going to go down a little bit, delete this one. Oops, I should have gone the other way. Go down a little bit, delete this last one. George Hotz and I both use Control-U and Control-D. Very good move, by the way. Uh, okay, so we have this thing. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, I'm going to yank it, and I'll do something like 10P, right? Create a few of them. I'm going to go over. Uh, instead of hitting V, which is visual line, I'm going to hit Control-V, which is column. Now that I have these selected, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go like this, G, Control A, Control A, because I'm using Tmux and Control A is my prefix. I have to send it twice to send it through Tmux into Vim. So if you weren't using Tmux, it'd just be G, Control A, and it'd auto increment along those lines. You know what I'm talking about? Where's this? This is just this is just Mimo. Arrays are just JS objects. This is not true at all. People say this all the time. They're just simply incorrect. Okay. You're just incorrect. I appreciate that, but you are incorrect. Even the most simplest, uh, even the most, sim uh, the simplest performance test can show you that there is a difference. That's Lua code, my dude. Arrays are linked lists in JS. No, they're not. Also, again, the simplest performance test will show you that they're not. They're array lists. They're, 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 they're array lists would be the proper term or dynamic lists. Yeah, I know. Arrays are arrays in JS. Also wrong. They're, ar they're dynamic arrays or array lists. What the hell happened, people? What the hell happened to you that you guys are so confused on this, okay? What the hell happened? Can we talk about this for a second? Do you, do you, are you okay? Arrays are undefined. This might be the most sensible thing that anyone said. Who hurt you? Arrays are ligma. They're absolutely... Arrays are special objects in JS. Something like a vector. There we go. Now we're getting play uh, plays. Array list is the worst name ever. No, it's not. It's actually a pretty reasonable name. It's a list that has a backing data structure of array. It's from JavaScript, or it's from Java. Everyone knows that's where JavaScript came from. And uh, yeah, it's pretty good. My parents say I'm special. It's an object. It's... <laughs> this guy's like, what the foot? What the hell did you just say? It's it's an object. That's optimized by the engine, really. It's just not it's it's just an object. You really gonna do that? You really you you really gonna do that? You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna give you a little hint right now. There are different types. Okay, just because you do type of and it says object, it doesn't mean it's an object. Okay. Guys! Stop it! Oh my goodness. Pro prove him wrong, daddy. Okay, so here. Here's a here's a very simple way. Oh, what is PHP? Uh it's an array. They 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 are aligned memory underneath the hood. Now, what what do they represent? They're a set of aligned references underneath the hood that have a capacity. Did you know that there's capacity underneath the hood? Did you know that every array comes with capacity? Did you know that? There's actually a pre-allocated region for references to other heap items. And so if you happen to have a SME, then it's going to be the heap reference is the small integer. If you don't have that, it's going to actually be a pointer somewhere else. So arrays are just vectors. Arrays are vectors. That's all they are. Well, they're vectors plus all the funny handling of other things, right? Now, obviously, if you change it, it will change its behavior, right? What I mean by that is if you just start adding properties to arrays, they have to fall back to something else, right? Because now you have two different things you're storing on it. I don't know exactly what Welcome they do, but Costco. my guess is that I if you start you. doing that, it probably falls back to like your standard stuff. This is also not true. Go on a kick, nerd. You know what I mean? In C, arrays are pointers. No, they're not. 
In C, arrays are arrays. You reference an array with a pointer. Arrays are not pointers, okay? Damn it, people! All right, who just got timed out? Going to kick nerd. Hey, that was actually pretty good. I thought that, I thought that meant like he was gonna like you know Bertrand. You're a little bit ba- you're a little band heavy today. What's going on, Bertrand? Are you kind of upset? Are you like a little upset right now? Are we are we good, Bertrand? So what happens if you do this? Uh, that's a good question. It may it, it will probably do some sort of optimization to change its underlying uh, implementation because you're creating a sparse array at that point. That's a different that's a different question, right? You're creating a different data structure. In Africa, every 60 seconds, a minute passes. That's un- that's not true. Going to kick, nerd. Pretty sure uh, he meant kick the streaming platform. Ah, what the fuck is going on with this so-called knowledge? <laughs> Dude, what I learned today is that Twitch chat is genuinely one of the worst places to get information from. When you declare an array in C, you declare a pointer to uh, an array on the stack. low level learning can you just can you just type something in here low level learning literally false thank you thank you low level learning you literally allocate a spot on the on the stack yes and it actually does do it increments the stack pointer and then it points to the point in that stack pointer it actually does create an array by incrementing the stack pointer now if you create it on the heap it also does the same thing but with the heap and malloc okay This is the dumbest conversation I've ever had in my lifetime. Stack pointers are for nerds. Oh my goodness. I only trust high level learning. Arrays are unlinked hash maps in Java. Who says these things? Okay, everybody shut up. I want every everybody shut up for a second. What is happening in this chat? I can hardly believe this is the dumbest version of conversation you have. Okay. Okay, that was Hey, shout of the dev. Appreciate you. Uh, I really do appreciate you. Okay, I really do. Karen, you know, I know we've been having... Uh, I mean, I know that hiring devs have become a little bit harder these days. But I think we may need to level up our bar just, just a little bit. Um... I was having some recent uh, conversations, Karen. And, well, let's just say that it was illuminating. And I think I got my stack pointer stuck in someone's ass. I just realized that's not, that does not translate one to one to foot. (laughs) Yes. I realized that's not a, that did, that definitely missed. I definitely missed on that joke. 100%. Uh, thank you for the, uh, thank you for the following. Arrays are a sequence of bytes in memory. Thank you. All right. Anyways. Okay. So we have a bunch of different events here. Okay. Welcome to Costco. I love you. I guess I don't really need to do a typed event, right? I mean, it's it's already a typed event, right? I mean, it's technically... I mean, this thing... There we go. Event. There we go. Perfect. All right. So we have this event. Let's go function. Let's go export. Export. Create event. Boom, boom, boom. Welcome and to Costco. let's go like this. Oh, welcome you. to Costco. I love you, too. Cons- welcome uh, to actually, Costco. Actually, let's put this down here. I oh, love you. I do love you, actually. I could learn to love you. You know, with the with the with the light reflecting off the seaweed. I didn't notice you back then. I could learn to love you. Can I have that funky ball of tits now? Uh hey, Sean Pye, thank you very much, and Fitzy TV. If anybody understands that reference, I would be very impressed. I'd be very impressed if anyone can anyone say that. With this type of code, I no longer want to learn Rust. Uh, I'm old Greg! Yeah, that's right. Uh, all right, thank you. Oh, damn, what happened? TJ's minion. Okay, let's Fantastic go. Fantastic stream so far, Prime. 
However, you know what is the also a fantastic stream? <laughs> TJ, Teej provides fantastic streams for anyone wanting programming content. Go check out TJ, everyone. <laughs> Oh, you guys think you're funny, don't you? Um, let's go like this. Obj, uh, event, or sorry. Let's create a little type. Let's call this thing type. I don't know why I didn't just rename it. That was good. That was good. I appreciate that, okay? Don't you like how this thing changes depending on how you use, uh, where you define your type? One's an error, one's not the error. Now I have to do this really annoying thing. Okay. This is a really annoying thing we're about to have to do, okay? I don't like it. We're just going to have to do it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this. I don't really care. We're just trying to make a simple a simple thing here, okay? So if I wish switch statements were better. Uh, type equals a event one. This is where, okay, so this is where Copilot should hopefully just come in real good, okay? Object dot, let's go like this. Object dot type this. There we go. Metric one equals, um, uh, what is it? It's 2 to the 31 times math.random. And let's give it a nice little math.floor. Oh, why do that? Why do that? If we're going to be this, if we're going to be this badass, let's not even do that. You know what I mean? Let's just go. Let's just hit him with one of those. Bam. Okay. Just a bunch of numbers. All right. All right. Well, oh, study time. I honestly, study time. I honestly thought it was another person doing a donation so they could say stupid stuff on the internet at me. Okay. I thought it was that. I didn't realize you actually rated me. Hey, everybody, you do see that? You see that heart up here that I'm hovering over? If you don't press it, you're banned. What on God's green earth is this? Well, programming. We're doing some memory. Uh, people say stupid things on the internet? No. Yeah, ban. Okay, Bertrand has been a little, little, little ban happy. Bertrand, you don't have to ban everyone. I appreciate your effort, but a little too much, okay? All right. Hit him with that one, 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 that one. I could actually do this faster at this point, Copilot. Uh, so this isn't cool. Can you just give them all to me? Just give them all to me. Just do all of them right now, please. Okay. I really don't appreciate this. Uh, I really don't. Um... Whoopsies! I just realized I can't do that. Uh, let's let's go like this. Uh, not uh, nine. Um, what do we gotta do here? Uh, let's see. Uh, G A A. Oh man. Uh, there it there it is. There's the cutoff line. Welcome to Costco. There's the cutoff Hello. line. We got him. All right, come on. You got this, Copilot. You can do it, Copilot. You can do it, Copilot. I just realized I don't have chat on screen. I'm sorry, chat. There you go, chat. Come on on. C come on on screen. Come on, chat. Come on, co-pilot. You can do it. Thank you, co-pilot, for uh, uh, doing whatever it was that you did, which, might I add, is not impressive. Thank you, co-pilot. Something about Copilot being impressive, uh, I know exists, but I don't know why it. Oh, was this my big one? <laughs> you know what I mean? You know what I mean? All right, did I get, did I do? Oh, I did do a no, number five. All right, let's do this one. Okay, thank you, Copilot. Thank you, Copilot, for being, I mean, se semi reasonable. There we go. All right, we got it. This is just a bunch of random events. This is effectively what I'm doing at Netflix, okay? Obviously, we're creating a server that's like, um, you know what I mean? Obviously, we're creating a junk data server, right? So why are you repeating so much co code, though? No. Why are you repeating so much code, though? No? Uh, because it was easy, right? It was easy. That's why. That's why, okay? I know. I could obviously put these in a bunch of maps, and then I have to have a bunch of maps that do a bunch of things, uh, right? Like, if I could do something like, uh, if I could just go like this, const keys equals uh, key of, uh, like, say, event four, then this would be sweet. You know what I mean? 
But this, I, I can't just get the keys. I can't get a, a real value from it. I don't think so. You know what I mean? Uh, you go back to Rose Pride. No. What did Theo have to say? Oh, yeah. I saw this. It's very beautiful. Oh, my goodness. That was loud. Here. All right. Let's, let's try lowering down the volume. And let's see what happens here. There's this new framework out called Balenciaga JS, and it's out to get all of you. Look at TJ. Look at how beautiful TJ. That's TJ, by the way. I didn't realize that was TJ, but apparently that is TJ. Okay, can, I hope everybody knows who this is. Okay. I hope everybody knows who this is. Clearly. That, that was supposed to be Tej. Yeah, this is Ken for sure. Ken, this was like Ken 10 years ago before he drank too much whiskey. Balenciaga. Oh my goodness. That is me. Balenciaga JS will make me completely obsolete. <laughs> that was pretty good. Can anyone guess who this is supposed to be? Can anyone guess who this is supposed to be? Like, without knowing. If you know, don't do it. Like, if you don't know who this is supposed to be, like, you didn't read the list, it's Bash. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's Bash Buddy. I did not guess that. I honestly did not guess that at all. I had just, gen I just genuinely had no idea who this was. But now that I know that it's Bash, I'm like, oh, yeah, that's Bash. That's AI Bash for sure. I, I think this is supposed to be Melky. But this would be, like, thin, definitely not hitting the gym, Definitely. This is definitely like if Melky had a soy doppelganger. By the way, every time I say soy dev or something on that, I literally get 25 comments on YouTube being like, you know, I, I don't think it's very kind of you to say the word to say the word soy when talking about uh, de devs. Okay, I'm a real dev too. I'm not. What you're saying hurts my feelings. Uh, dude, get over it. Okay, call me a soy dev. I don't care. I don't care. Okay, it doesn't matter. Stop being so concerned about things. I just saw this comment. This dude, I got probably twenty-five of them this morning. You know, soy dev and proud. Yeah, be a soy dev and be proud of it. Okay, it's okay. Look at Melky. That's Melky. Balenciaga JS will make you a super senior software engineer for sure. Okay. <laughs> There's everybody's second favorite streamer right here. Second favorite streamer. Clearly trash dev. Clearly trash dev. I honestly have no idea who that's supposed to be. It almost looks like they created a weird version of Rich Harris. Who is this supposed to be? That's rocks? Ninja? Coding with Luke? No, it's rocks codes. It's rocks codes. It's rocks codes, everybody. It's Rox Codes. Damn, that does not look like Rox at all. And his hand is gone. Poor Rox, man. He's holding what appears to be a selfie stick with no selfie ability. Everything else looks pretty spot on, though, about Rox. Adam.dev. This is Adam.dev. If Adam.dev and the older brother to Will had a baby on Stranger Things. Am I correct on that one? I think so. I'm correct on that one, aren't I? I think I am. That's who this is. Balenciaga helps me ship faster than PHP. Okay, so who was this? Is this supposed to... Okay, I know that there's a joke that there's someone from Levels IO. Levels IO. Okay, okay, so this is supposed to be Levels IO. I have no idea who this person is. Justin Bieber. This actually looks like a real person here. Programmer? Okay. Clearly Jack Forge. Balenciaga is the superior framework. I recommend you use it. <laughs> is that fire ship? <laughs> what? There's no way that's fire ship. And that's fire ship. <laughs> this what is this 
Began, yeah, there's no Began. Began definitely should have been in there. Uh, Began would have been great. Uh, by the way, go follow um, Hill. He is awesome. Obviously, King Memer here, okay? King Memer. Really appreciate all of his work. He makes some good works out here. But this is hilarious. I cannot believe that's Fire Ship. Second comment tells you who are, I know that's, but I didn't want to look at them. This is kind of like a post look at, like only when you don't know. What is Balenciaga? They're a clothing company that is best known for child stuff. Not good stuff. They don't have a great rep in the, in the, uh, in the, in the old media, in the histories. You know, I, I just, uh, it's not, uh. Yep, they're that, you know. Uh, that's all I'm going to say about them. That's it. Anyways, uh, this is great. I don't want to, yeah, you don't, you don't want to Google them. Fashion company, enough said. Yeah, actually, fashion company is probably the closest. You just need to say the word fashion company. That pretty much nails exactly what you would expect. TJ was great. AI TJ was fantastic because he truly, like, you can definitely see this is TJ. Is, I think his nose is a little small for TJ, but this is like definitely TJ material right there. Like he has the long hair. TJ always had super long hair for so long. It's very, very good. Their photo shoots have been controversial. Exactly. There you go. That's what they're best known for is exceptionally controversial photo shoots, shall we say. To be the most bland version you can be of it. Uh, AI Prime is too skinny. Yeah, I know. I'm a little bit more chiseled than that, boys. Uh, all right. Anyways, this is fantastic. Good job, Mahil. Uh, AI Prime needs uh, some bulk. Hell yeah, girl. All right. So we have the crappiest code in the universe. I just didn't really want to write all these out. I wonder if it would have been easier with Copilot. Let's find out. Cons, uh, event, uh, keys one. Let's see. Can I go like this? Event one uh, keys equals, come on. Oh, baby, it does work. Event two keys, come on. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Give it to me, daddy. Ah. Okay, so I didn't think this would be easier. We do have a problem here. We do have a little bit of a problem here, which it should be key of uh, event one in an array, right? You got to kind of kind of do this or else it kind of sucks. Come on, give me event two. Uh, key of event two. There we go. We'll do one of those. Let's put back the music back on. Uh, there we go. And uh, key of event uh, three. Boom. Uh, key of event four. There we go. Key of event. Uh, oops, that's not it. Oops, that's not it. Uh, event five. There we go. But one of those. Okay, so this, I think, looks correct. Wait, what, what the hell's your problem? Uh, Read-only metric uh, cannot be assigned to key of that. Why not? Why not? Por que, Maria? Doesn't that seem right? Doesn't that seem good? What the hell's going on there? Add as const. Oh, no, no do I have to type in read-only? Yeah, yeah, that's right. See, I've done a, I've done a decent amount of TypeScript. People always think that I have not done that much TypeScript, okay? I've done a pretty smooth bit of TypeScript, people. All right, let's go like this. Um, let's go uh, return, and we'll go like this. Let's just take this thing out, take that bad boy out, take one of those bad boys out, take one of those bad boys out, hit them with the type, then let's spread in this, and let's do the one thing that I think is the actual worst thing to do, which is always just the worst thing to do. It, every single time I hate doing Welcome this. To Costco. Uh, let's Hello. do one of those, and let's go like this. As event uh, one, put it in there. Uh, event one, put one up there. That always makes everything feel good. Return ack, and then go like this. Ack key equals that. Let's go. Okay. You. All right, so what the hell's your problem? Why Welcome you got to be like to Costco. this? I, love you. I hate this. I hate this. Why? What is key? Key is key of event one. What is ACK? Event one. Why? I, okay, so this is the one thing I just don't understand very well. You know what I mean? This is that thing that I just don't get. You know what I mean? I just don't get it. 
Are you actually using VS Code uh, 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 Vim on VS Code? Hell yeah. VS Code is stupid. Uh, Long Blue Trail. Thanks for giving some excitement to the workday. No problem. And Matt Trezol, thank you for the Twitch Prime. And Alpert, thank you for the, you know, thank you. Many appreciations. Let's go star power! And the Totenatum. Thank you for the resubscribe. By the way, if you did not, if you did not go follow study time, you're a piece, you're a piece of shit. Uh, also, uh, F Fitzy, thank you, and Sean P. I already know I said thank you, but thank you again. Uh, hello, world. It's world. Hey, you have to redefine the type on the second R, but I already, it is, it is already properly a type. It's key of event one, right? I could go like this, key of event one, right? Which would totally be correct. And this thing being event one, which would totally be correct. And now it's gonna be like, well, actually, we don't know if it is. We don't actually know if it is. Actually, uh, this is super confusing. All right, how do you, how do you, I think my problem here is that I'm going to drop this. I'm going to drop, I'm going to drop all of these right here, okay? Uh, read only dot star equals, uh, yeah. So, oopsies. Let's just, let's just drop all these and see if that fixes things. Ah, damn, I was really hoping that would just fix things. Welcome to Costco. Uh, but it didn't. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, the reason why it was messed up is because a key, if it's if, if it's a key of the event, but the event has both a number and a string as a possibility, therefore it cannot be assigned. Hey, fuck off, mate! Hey, thank you for the follow. Appreciate that. Imagine not having a Hindley Mil a Milner system. Yeah. Uh, type into reduce initial value so you don't need the spread. Oh, yeah. Why not? Nice job. Look at that. I, I right now I don't really I don't really care about efficiency here. This is not where I care about efficiency. You know what I mean? Uh, let's see. Let uh, keys. I really don't want to have to repeat this code a whole bunch. And so this is what I'm going to do instead. I'm going to be smart here. Watch this one. Okay. I'm just going to go like this. Object equals event. Let. Uh, okay. I'm just going. I'm going to be so so damn smart here. Okay. I physically hate you. Uh, we're just going to go like this. We're going to go like this. TS ignore. You know why? We don't care. Okay? We don't care. And then this is what we're going to do. Const keys equals uh, event one. Event one. No, 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 copilot. Okay. Now that we have that as const. Thank you. We don't even need as const. Uh, let's go like this. Let uh, keys equals math.random. No. Go. Uh, where are you? Oh, I don't, I don't even have that thing right at all. Uh, Keys.length times that. Uh, Math.floor that. There we go. All right, fantastic. And go key. There we go. Oh, gosh. Event keys. And we're going to just do a bunch of ignoring now, okay? You know why? Because we don't want to actually have to do this. All right, do one of these and go event keys. There we go. And we're just going to ignore this thing. And we're just going to pass in obs, right? And we're going to drop uh, this to const and then do that because apparently I'm bad at typing. Do one of these. Let's not even care what the thing's coming out of here. Honestly, let's not even care, okay? Let's not even care. Uh, event keys. Event keys is going to be this. Yep, reduce what's your effing problem. This expression is not callable. Uh, you can go F yourself. Is that, is that, a, is that an option? Is that an option? Because guess what? It is, it is callable, okay? Again, absolutely hate. Absolutely. There we go. How about that one? Okay. Whatever. Fuck off. All right. Uh, as. Okay. Perfect. All right. There we go. Minimal amount of uh, starting to look better. Yeah. Minimal amount. Okay. There we go. TS ignore. Yeah. I'm using TypeScript just to use TS ignore. I know. This is JavaScript. I know. Screw it. We don't care. Just let it happen. Okay. All right. There you go. Look at that. Does it feel better now? Uh, I, I really wonder why. Uh, I just hate the fact that event keys is clearly one of these many keys. It's, it's clearly an array. And this thing is unable to reduce over that array. I know you're going to give me some dumbass reason why it's not possible. I get it. Okay. I get it. I get it. And you're going to tell me the exact same thing about like find. Okay. It's like, hey, we don't know how to do find either. 
Okay. Oh, find is impossible to do on this thing. We don't even know what it is. It's impossible. It's impossible to understand life, liberty, and love. Okay. Why not? It just isn't. <clears throat> it's just frustrating is what it is. Truth or dare challenge. He was fighting to get fired. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bro's losing his mind. Nah. This is just shitty. This is just this is just shitty language problems. Okay, there we go. We got a bunch of fake ass events. Now we're gonna get our little data server. Okay, so when you contact this data server, this is what I'm going to do. I'm gonna hit you with a little plain text. Okay, and I'm gonna do this one. And I'm gonna go like this. Uh, while, while, uh, oh, wrong language. We're gonna do. Actually, let's just do a for loop. For let i equals zero. I has to be less than. Let's go like this. Const count equals. Uh, Welcome to Costco. I love you. Let's go process.arg v2 2 or a thousand. Yeah, or a million. Million seems a little high. Let's go with a hundred thousand. That's a pretty normal amount of objects. Homie can type type. Yeah, baby. You know I can. Slimzy, thank you very much. I got to turn up the volume. Sorry. Slimzy, I appreciate that. Hey, hi, Welcome homie. To Costco. Thank you. I love you. Four true true. TypeScript was a mistake. It's always been a mistake. Uh, count. Do that. All right. So now that we have that, we're going to go like this. Right. Oops. Whoopsies. We're going to do a little quick write on this one. And we're just going to go like this. Um, what the hell? What the hell is the thing called? Right? It was called. What are you called? You're called create event. That's what you're called. Create event. Do one of those. And let's go like this. Jason.stringify. Put one of those. And of course, do one of that. A uh, little too much garbage for me, so let's go res right, do one of those. There we go. And we're going to do that. And then we're going to go await, wait zero. I like it. And let's go function, wait, TypeScript, or uh, Copilot. You already know how to implement this. Thank you very much. All right, fantastic. Beautiful. Sounds good. Uh, do one of those. There we go. How are we doing? Chat, how do you move the cursor into the LSP uh, preview window? Double K, dog. Double K, dog. All right, Copilot. Uh, why no use Express? Because uh, we're not using Express. That's why. Okay, we're making this thing minimal. It's simple. It's simple. It's simple. So do you see what's happening here? We're going to just simply write out events. So this is going to take a moment to get everything completed, right? So if I go in here and I go like this, npx ts node, uh, source, uh, data server, toss up one of these bad boys, and then I'm going to go in here and I'm going to go curl, uh, blah, 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 blah. Let's see, uh, HTTP, localhost 420, uh, 42069, and do this. It's just going to write for a while, right? We got ourselves a huge set of different types of metrics, event five, event four, event five. You get the idea. Um, you got some event two, some threes, right? We have a bunch of metrics, okay? Rip bitrate, bitrate can't handle shit. Uh, th that was like playing Tarkov. You wanna see Tarkov? Tarkov. Uh, there we go. What does a wait, wait do? It, it just, it, it does a set time on zero. It just waits for one process tick, right? Twitch encodings go brrr. All right. What's your streaming bit rate? Only uh, 40 some hundred. I can't handle it right now. I gotta, I gotta get a new hardwire into my room. Ruling Mink, thank you very much. When I get a new hardwire, it's gonna be awesome. I open preview with OmniFunk. Uh, but I can only select options with arrow keys. Ew, gross. Have you tried control P or N? You know what I mean? All right, hey, hey there, Gustavo. Ooh, Gustavo. Ooh, my Brazilian friend, my Gustavo. I, let's see, I always have a hard wire in my room. Oh, damn, no tech react today. Uh, I, I reacted to your, your stuff, but no. Today, we're actually doing exploration. I'm actually doing, like, important work for my job. All right, so I have this beautiful piece of code. This will all work. This was fantastic. Let's take that. And now let's create a kind of like our little ingest server, right? I don't really care what it's called. Let's call it ingest because it sounds way, way smarter than you, okay? You know what I mean? Like, how much smarter do I sound right now? like a lot smarter than you. Can we agree to that? Can we agree how much smarter this guy sounds than you? Yeah, he sounds smarter than you. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know, you know what I mean? Um, ingesties what? What do I get ingest? How do I get that in me? Real talk. 
No. Okay. You're smarter and uh, you are smarter. You sound smarter and you are smarter, potentially. All right. Welcome to Costco. Ooh, thank you I very much, you. Flame Lurker. I appreciate that. Three months on that Twitch Prime, baby. All right. So let's do our little ingest. We actually need none of that. I don't even know what we're doing. We don't need any of that. All right. So let's just do some basic memory housing for a moment and kind of figure out what the hell's going on here, okay? Welcome to Costco. Because I think this is kind I of like an interesting little thing we could do right here, okay? We can do some things that I think are, are potentially kind of exciting. You want to hear me talk about exciting? Well, guess what? We're about to do it. Do you see what my hands are doing? It's kind of weird looking, right? What the hell am I doing? I don't know, but it feels good. Uh, anyways... So let's just let's just keep this pretty simple. Uh, make a request to localhost uh, for twenty sixty nine, and hopefully we can just get imp no uh, import HTTP. Do that. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Welcome to All Costco. Right. I love you. That looks good. And what do I get here? I get a callback. Son of a bitch. Is there like a promises version of this? All right. Uh, uh, function request. Uh, let's go like that. And let's go. Ooh, do we want to promise? I don't know if we want to promise. I don't know if we want to promise. Can I stream back the results? Uh, let's see. Const. Uh, request equals this. Let's find out something here. Okay, it's client request. Let's find out if we can process these things as they come in. Welcome to Costco. You know what I mean? um, I hey, Wallen Oxenfree, thank you very much for that. I appreciate that Costco. brand new Twitch and Prime. Shinta, thank you. Ingest me, Daddy. Oh, I will. Okay. And uh, I'm not. Hey, drugs aren't cool, kids. Um, subscribe again uh, for the top-notch content and awesome playlist. Hey, thank you. Uh, Adrian Roms, thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime, and subscribing for six months. Damn, a six months subscription, tier one. Look at that, six months in advance me from Somnia. From Somnia, thank you, thank you, many thank yous. Is All right. your car engine electric or a combustio? I all of a sudden lost my confidence. Thanks for the six month subscription. All right, I don't know what that was. Let me bring that back up because I think somebody was about to drop a D's nuts, D's nuts joke. And I'm not gonna lie to you, I love a good D's nuts joke. Okay, if you can if you can put a good D's nuts joke right in my mouth, love it. All right, here we go. We got to go over to stream elements. Is your car engine electric or a combustio? If you if you read the text, it says, "Is your car uh, engine elect electric or combustio?" My car is Shadowfax. Lord of the Horses. Okay, people. All right, let's go. Let's do this. Which is it? Hey, uh, from Somnia. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. All right, so we got this little request. Can we do a little request data? Can we do that? Or can we do an on? Oh, hell yeah. Can we do a little data? What do we got here? Do we got a pipe? Do we got a drain? What is drain? What are all these things? How can I... I, I want to know if I get... I want to be able to get like information as it comes in. You know what I mean? What's the what's the get information as it comes in? Um, uh, get uh, get uh, data as it comes in from the request. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Oh. Oh, uh, okay. There's the incoming message. Okay. I knew incoming messages exist. I just didn't know where they were. Okay. So we have this thing. And so we can actually log out these things as they happen. That's right. That's right. 
That's right, Welcome damn it. Costco. All right, so let's go like this. I hey, hey, I love you too, baby. NPX, TS, uh, node. Uh, let's go like this. Server, ingest. Okay, that's, that's stupid. Host is local host. Port is 42069. Yeah, I mean, that seems right, right? Uh, 42069. Yep, 42069. 42069. Method is get. Absolutely. Path is that. Absolutely. I mean, this all looks good. Oh, oh, I killed my data server. Wait, did I kill my data server? What the hell's going on here? Chad debugging. I know. Response end? No. Uh, well, no, it's, it's just hanging. Uh, request, um... Oh, is there an end I have to make? Is And calling the right... Let's see. Method signals that there's no more data to be written to the writable. Ah, okay. Oh, so I can jump in here. And so this is how we... Is this how we just, like, write it all out? Okay, this is not what I wanted to see, but okay. Is that... Is that... Or is there, like, a send method? Is there any other methods I should know about? Okay, end. Why not? You got that? Did that crash my server? It didn't crash my server. Okay, this is good. Okay, so there we go. So now we're getting in these these we get these we get these mess we get these messages that are just gonna come flying in. So this is good. A first try, absolutely. Absolutely, sushi. First try. So now that we got these messages that are just coming flying in, we're going to take these messages and I want to start measuring a little bit of, you know, what's going on with this memory, okay? So let's find out. You know what I mean? Let's find out what's going on here. So I'm going to go like this. I'm going to go, uh, let's go, uh, let's just call this thing data and let's go back here and let's do that. Uh, data, yeah, baby girl, do that. And let's go like this. Uh, function, export function, uh, call API. Why not? That seems uh, that seems reasonable, right? I do one of those. New, uh, return new, oh my goodness, new promise. There we go. We'll do one of those. All right, so we get this one. We're going to do all this. We're going to do this. And this is where we don't want to do the promise. Instead, we're going to go like this. Res response. There we go. Cannot find that. Uh, it's resolve. And I guess request dot on error. Let's do it. Uh, reject. Reject me, daddy. There we go. Doesn't that look good? All right, so there we go. So we have this nice little beautiful thing that we can get, and we can await for the actual request to go through. And then once it goes through, we can then listen and start processing these events as they come flooding into us. Okay, does this look pretty good? I think this looks pretty good. Hey, Adbo, 664. First off, I, f I feel like your permissions aren't really quite there for me. You know what I mean? Like, I would expect you to, you know, right now you're kind of like, what, at best, SSH? I'm feeling a little nervous here. Oh my goodness, toggle bit, toggle buns. My boy, toggle buns. Toggle buns, you've officially pushed me over the edge to 2000, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I need to see some 755s. Uh, toggle bit, I want you to name Welcome your favorite permissions uh, octal. Okay, what is it? What's your favorite permissions Welcome octal? Welcome to Costco. Uh, me personally, it's you. 755, okay? It feels good. It feels like there's a lot of opportunity there, but at the same time, it's not too much. You know what I mean? What do you think? Where are you, Toggle? Tell me. 666, why 666? Every time I hear that, I always think of that, are we the bad guy skit? You know what I mean? Six 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 would be only uh would be only read write right. Are we the baddies?
Oh, yeah, I've actually subscribed to Chad Jeopardy 4. Really? Uh, well, uh, Mitchell and Webb? Uh, okay, okay. Anyways, yeah, so 666 is uh, is just read and write, right? Welcome you cannot execute, right? Is that I is that what you. it is? I always forget the ordering of those things. It's just read write, right? For the insane. The imp <laughs> su su Pseudo, you can't touch this one. I think it's read write. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, I got it right in my head. Chamoud, 69. Fuck Octal. <laughs> Read right XQ. Yeah, 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 I have two things for you quickly, Karen. Um, I did not prepare a rating gift for either study time, teach, or toggle bit. Do you think you could prepare something for us? That'd be really good. Uh, second off, Karen, um, we got a nine-monther, Twitch Prime, committed to the startup. I want you to get out there. I want you to give him a brand new Lenovo laptop so he, too, can experience throwing it off the roof and showing Lenovo exactly how. We think of them. I'd be really impressed by that. I think that'd be a good gift. You know what I mean? Just he can he can throw it underhand, overhand, you know, discus style, whatever whatever he wants to do. All right, make a cake, but the cake is a lie. Damn. Uh, anyways, thank you, Joker, for that uh, gifted sub. I appreciate that. And Carlos, again, brand new Twitch Prime. Appreciate that. Meme master. By the way, meme master right here. Hey, link your YouTube again. Link your YouTube. We're going to get you up to 1,000 subs. Oh, uh, Oxheart, thank you very much. I love you. Link your YouTube right now. Link it up. Spit when you say Lenovo. Thank you. Remember when Lenovo made a foam pit that several people got injured and they just never said sorry? Do you, do you remember that? You remember when that happened? That they just made a death pit and never said sorry once to anybody. All right, hey, go subscribe to the Meme Master. Look at that. He just started his YouTube channel, okay? Oh, at TwitchCon, yeah, when when they permanently damaged a young lady. Broke a knee, a wrist, if, I, if I'm not mistaken. Ruined several people's lives. And just never said sorry. Yeah, spinal. <laughs> like, full-on Mike Tyson. Spinal. Uh, it's, it's called not admitting fault legal strategy. Yeah. Her porn career is over. Uh, yes, you got it. Yeah. There we go. Hey, give this kid a follow. Okay. We'll react to his next video if he wants us to. If you want us to, we'll react to it. Thank you for giving him some more subs. He's very funny. I like him. Okay. All right, anyway, so let's keep on going. So, okay, so there we go. We have this nice little API. It's all nice and wrapped up, which means I should be able to go into my little my little ingester. And what we want to do is I want to be able to create a bunch of memory and see exactly what does it do, right? I want to make a request, hold it for five seconds, let everything go. All right, what, we'll start off with this. We'll just make requests... I like that. I like that. Uh, have a good one. Hey, thank you, uh, Asborn. Have a good one. We'll just make requests, parse them, store them until the end of the request, and then we will uh, let them all go, and then we'll do the cycle again and again and again. Does that sound good? I think that sounds pretty good. So let's just try that out right now. Let's just see what happens, okay? So we're going to go like this. Function, uh, async function, uh, uh, key, keep it hard. <laughs> All right, while true, let's go. All right, so first thing we want to do is uh, re uh, the response, right? So we're going to want to go await and then go here. What is it called? Call API, uh, call API, bam. All right, so we're going to get the response. And after we get the response, we now need to just do something with it. So strategy one, function, strategy one, which this one's just going to simply hold on to the JSON events, right? We're going we're gonna to stringify the JSON events 
and that's that. Right? You know what I mean? Ooh, that's a good point. Uh, let's see. Let uh, hard equals true. Thank you. You know what? Actually, that's one thing to th you know. That's one way to do it. You know, but I prefer something else around here. Okay, I prefer something else uh, else around here. There we go. Now that, my friends, is the perfect form of programming. The best. The best programming out there. All right, so now that we got the best programming out there, this is what we want. Is we get the response, and now we're going to do strategy one, okay? It is art. It's ASCII art, mostly. Uh, HTTP um, incoming message. Yeah, 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 that guy. They're going to be like, what's a uh, Im import uh, HTTP? Bam. There we go. All right. So so there we go. We got keep it hard. We're going to do that. We're going to go strategy one. Let's go like that. Await oh, this. There we go. Wait, what? Wait, what? All right, let's go like this. Ah. All right, so each one of these lines, we should just assume I'm going to make the assumption. I know it's an unfair assumption, but I'm going to make the assumption that each one of these should be JSON uh, string, uh, JSON parsable. You know what I mean? Brian Jen, is this uh, the famous strategy pattern? Effectively, we're going to have a... Effectively, it's a strategy pattern. Yeah. Right. So I'm going to go like this. Uh, const uh, data... Ooh, let's go like this. Event... There we go, and let's go like this. So we're going to start off with this one. It's not going to really be a strategy pattern because the return signature is incorrect. But just to have this thing be long enough lived to be able to live to this part, let's try it out. Because I have this theory. Okay, so here's my theory. Is everybody ready for my theory about garbage collection? I have never tested it, so I need, I need a theory. Are you guys ready for my theory? Theory. Theory time. All right, so here's my theory that garbage collection is the fastest when you have to hold on to an object for only one process tick. So that's my hypothesis. Now we're going to see, is it true? Wrong. Wrong. Okay, K Kinzen, why don't you tell me then, tough guy? Why don't you tell me then, tough guy? And so, you know, because I know they, they do nursery stuff. And so I know there is some level of, uh, of lifetime. Um, garbage collection is for garbage men, so don't get occupied. Tech. I had just a theory, a garbage collecting theory. Let's get back in. Kinsen, get out of here. All right. Hey, by the way, uh, a rag. Thank you very much for that. A little something, something. Oh, baby, give it to me. What is it? Are you toying with me? Are you toying with me? Welcome to Costco. A little I something, you. something. You're going to come into this chat and you're not going to actually give me a little something, something.
Welcome thank you, everybody else, for trying Hello. to make me happy. Kinson, thank you for giving me a little something, something. Uh, Pyre MC, thank you for a little something, something. Okay, I appreciate that. And by the way, Security Live, how you doing, buddy? I see you've been streaming in the mornings lately. It's not that they're not allowing me to create something in Rust. There's just no infrastructure for it. There's a lot of infrastructure. Hey, thanks for the follows. You guys running a you guys running a solid follow train on my ass. Look at that. Six follows in less than a minute. You follow trained my ass so good. Feels good, you know, when you think about it. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh! Oh! Oh, he subbed and then did it! Oh, yes, give it to me! <laughs> I know. I shouldn't have yelled, give it to me. I get it. Okay. Um, I just wanted it. You know? You know what I mean, Karen? Like, sometimes you just want you just want it. And so, I just figured I could just yell it. You know what I mean? Is that... Oh, wait. Let me guess. Yelling, giving it... It is in the employee handbook, huh? Okay. Okay, then. No, shut up, Beast Co. Just let it happen. Shut up, Beast Co. Let it happen. All right. Thank you very much. The zebras are greater than houses. Thank you for that. We have no warnings, okay? Okay, we have a couple warnings. Let me fix all of them, okay? This is not a strict type language, so it's a little bit easier. All right, so when we have this, so this right here should just be a, uh, what is this? Porque, Maria, what is this thing? This thing should just be a string, so I should be able to go like this. Data dot, okay, okay. Give them the D. Push the D in, Okay. We push the D in. Let's go. <laughs> Pushing it in. All right. Did, uh, did Bisco call something yet uh, this stream? He calls everything. Every stream. Rabbits greater than Prime. Is that true? I like to imagine that each time the car scene is shown, Prime manually recreates it and screams. It is true. Insert the D into the array. Hell yeah, girl. All right. So now that we've done that... We'll go like this, res dot on uh, end, uh, resolve, okay, uh, resolve data. If res, uh, let's see, if res dot on uh, error, then you know what we need to do. Jump up here, go like that, go reject, and put one of those, and put one of those, and go down here, and put in a reject, and, and do one of these, and pass in one of those, and get the hell out of here. You know what I mean? Pretty classic programming that just went on there. So there's this theory is plausible. If you wait for uh, more than one process tick and the performance is worse, yes. Well, more time is spent in garbage collection. That's my theory, okay? So I'm going to start off with the simplest, the simplest one, which is just like what you would do, right? So if you are getting a bunch of events that you need to process and they effectively come in line by line and there's not really a guarantee of how fast it's going to happen you're going to get a few you're going to get a few effectively i'm making it really obvious here uh by cuz i'm just making the problem simpler i don't have to parse out the buffer and find uh new lines and then pull that out and then do that you know what i mean i'm not going to use super json get it, get the hell out of here um okay so i'm i'm keeping it really simple oh, that's scary. lithium Lithium. Lithium, last night I jumped in Tarkov. I did. It scared me. It scares me every single time. It's the scariest game in the universe, okay? I get scared playing it. By the way, this is the largest follow train in my lifetime. Thank you, everybody. The long, uh, the, I think longer live scope actually improves GC performance, less allocation. Um, I don't think you're thinking of it the same way I am. Oh, that scared me. Welcome to Costco. I love you. What? Welcome to Costco. I love Let's rewind you. this song slightly. I feel like this song just happened. I didn't realize how loud the music was. Was it loud today? Was it? Has it been loud today? I had no idea how loud this was today. Um... There we go. 
there is voice donation. Yeah, you can just do bang donate. Hey, Uncle Scientist, thank you for the 100 biddies. Hey, uh, and Ann Placid, thank you for that. I appreciate that. But okay, and Pi, uh, Pi, uh, uh, Pig Arroyo, thank you very much for that. Twitch Prime, six months. Let's go. Okay, Lithium, Crimson. What is this? What is this? Real talk. Coming in with the hundo. Lithium, what the hell's going on? That's twice today. You've scared me with your little bangs. Pew, pew. Okay? It's terrifying. Thank you. Appreciate that. Preach. You're welcome. Thank you. What song is this? This is just a Mimo podcast. All right, let's go, people. Let's get back into it. Okay, so right now we have Keeping It Hard. We're just going to do strategy one. We're going to call it, do it, call it, do it, call it, do it. It's going to hold on to all the events, then let them go. Hold on to all the events, let them go. Hold on to all the events, let them go. Hold on to all the events, let them go. You know what I mean? We're going to just do that over and over and over again. Okay, does that make sense? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let's call keeping it hard. There we go. We're keeping it hard, boys. Um, And then let's go like this. Let's go node modules. Let's go like this. Let's go NPM I. Give them the DTS. Node type script. Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah, brother. Hold my events, daddy. I will. Okay, and then let's go like this. Let's go like this. TSC init. Do one of those. Jump it back here. Uh, TS config. Oh gosh. Uh, config. Oh gosh. What happened there? And let's let's target uh, ES next, right? ES next, right? The, just the greatest. What's the greatest one out there? And then out dirt. Oh, we're about to have an emotional Welcome moment in the song. Hey okay, guys, you. can you hear that? It's getting emotional. Hell yeah, girl. All right. So there we go. We're gonna go like this. Uh, TSC compile that. I want to say thank you, Luz Fernando. Luz. Luz. Fernando. Welcome Luz to Costco. Fernando. A little sub you. sub coming. I knew you were going to give it to me. A little sub sub. I knew it. Okay, I could feel it. I could taste it. I knew it was going to give it to me. Thank you. I t appreciate that, Twitch Prime. How do you get so good at coding? Practice. Years and years of practice. I'm 37 here in a few months, okay? You lost me a bit in the TSK? Yeah, it's don't worry. Fernando. Every time I hear the name Fernando, I think has to be the sexiest man alive okay you don't just get a name like fernando for no reason okay okay uh no i don't drink any coffee i drink i drink one cup of coffee on saturday or I drink one to two cups of coffee every saturday other than that i get uh yerba mate this is just yerba mate baby fernando it's just such a good name alonzo oh alonzo is also a very good name it just has this power to it Fernando K. Grande, Eres Magic. I don't know meat. what that means, but I agree. Okay. Eric, thank you very much. A register. I appreciate the five gifted tier ones. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Uh, when YouTube streaming? YouTube is. YouTube is a bit boring. Uh, surely he knows a Fernando Alonso. Oh my goodness. Don't even. That can't exist. Too much sexy, one name. Uh, when you started to learn how to code, did it become natural or was it a struggle? Oh, it was a huge struggle, huge struggle. It's my name, bro. It's not a register. I kind of like the name A register. Alonso. 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 Wow. Anyway, someone said that YouTube, uh, 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 YouTube is like a uh, YouTube chat is uh, is like going to a gas station at 3 a.m. <laughs> I think parsing D will fail because the chunk you. of uh, of a string is not JSON. It is. I, I did a little secret here. Don't worry. I did a little secret. Thank you again for all those subs. 100 subs from Crimson, 20 from Lithium, and 12 from the rest of y'all, including a little something, something. Thanks for giving it to me, baby girl. And a register. The man's like, hey, hold on. That's my name. Hey, A register. Calm down, okay? I'm going to put something good in you, okay? Put a thank you in you. All right, anyways. Oh, is that Anna? Hey, Anna. All right, so now that we got this, let's go like this. Let's go node inspect Burke. Actually, we can just hit him with the inspect and go dist. And let's just hit him with the ingest server. Okay, so you're right. It didn't work. It turns on your bed. It didn't work. It I thought it might feeling. work. It didn't work. Okay. I thought it might work, but it didn't work. I was just hoping it was going to work first try. It didn't. Okay, let's go like this. Let's just see what we get through the... Let's just see what we get. I, I didn't want to have to manually parse it out line by line. To tell you the honest truth. Um, all 
I mean... Oh, that's a new line right there. Oh, the new line's coming in separately. What? Por que, Maria? Uh, see, that's the problem about doing anything on local, on local host, is that it's not always like true. You know what I mean? It's not like always true. Where, where, where was it? Where, where, where was it? See, like it's actually somehow getting both these events. Welcome to Costco. I love you. It's like not technically true, which is. You know what I mean? So normally, if you were to be doing this across the internet, you'd probably get this in a different kind of chunk. You wouldn't get this. You wouldn't get what's happening here. As a register, I can confirm that JS is a superior language to HTML facts. So, yeah, lo lo local host does something which is not quite as fair, I would say. <sighs> All right. I didn't want to have to do this because I don't... I don't know. It just bothers me to create a string like that. All right. So we're going to do that. So that should technically, oopsies. So that should technically throw up the server. Let's do this. And this should cause it to, uh, what? 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 Thanks, TypeScript. All right. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I like what we're seeing. Happy about it. Can we all agree we're happy about this? This is good. I know we're cheating a little bit, but that's okay. All right. So now that we have that thing done, let's go back to this thing. Let's uh, get rid of this console. And what we're going to do is we're just going to start running this thing nonstop, okay? So there we go. It's just chunking, right? We're chunking along right now, okay? We're chunking. We're getting chunky. Everyone close your eyes. Ugh. Um. Ugh. Ugh. Uh. All right, so let's do this guy. Let's bring up the little dev tools. Let's bring up this little guy right here. Let's do one of these. Let's do one of these. I kind of wish I had. I wish I had. I wish I had the other one. Let's see. Let's let's start a little 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 trace. Let's just let it run for a little bit, okay? We're going to just let it run. Uh, don't they have dark mode in Chrome? I don't know. I, I don't do anything to this one intentionally. Update Chrome, damn it. No. Welcome to Costco. Hey, Register. I I, uh, thanks uh, for the gifted sub. You're a legend. Absolutely. Can you pop the dev tools? The dev tools are popped, dog. Okay, so there we go. So we got a lot of stuff. Oh, we're, oh wow, look at that. Isn't it always funny to see that? Isn't this always sad to see that most of the time you're spending, you're actually just doing nothing? You know, like even those little five, even even those little five millisecond gaps, just nothing. Okay, just absolutely nothing. And so that means let's uh let's do a little something with that. Let's make sure we get a little bit. Let's get a little bit. Uh, all right, one of fourteen. What what does this thing look like? All right, so we're getting a, you know, it's, it's not very much garbage collection going on here. We're mostly just empty time. So let's go like this. Let's go back in here. And instead of doing this, let's start having this thing happen. Let's go with five times. Okay. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. All right, so now let's record this thing. And let's also uh, pgrep uh, node. Let's also take, why do I have so much node going on here? All right, so we're sitting right around some memory. We're gonna spike up, spike back down, spike up, spike back down is my guess. Or we're just gonna go upwards. That doesn't make any sense. Okay, I guess we're just, I guess Welcome we're just going up. Hey you. everybody, we're just going up. Oh, there we go, garbage collection. Fantastic. Okay, now we're going up again. Fantastic, right? Let's wait for one more jump down in memory. To the moon. Yeah, it's to the moon memory leaking. All right, so this is pretty good. Little high. Let's get one more. Come on, jump back down. Give it to me, girl. All the way down. All the way down. All the way down. 
It really doesn't want to go down. Hello, Prime Gen. Hello, Prime. Do you know anything about running dot .map on a 50 megabyte array uh, that turns it into one uh, gigabyte out of memory doom? Um, yeah, you're creating something. What are you creating? A dot .map. Remember, when you do a dot .map, you are creating an array of equal size. So if you're creating a bunch of new objects, you want to guess what's going to happen? You want to guess what's going to happen? Okay. That's long enough. So let's do this. Let's stop this thing. Okay. So we got a lot. Let's see. How, how much idle time do we have now? We're still pretty idle. Mm, I think I know the problem. I think I know the problem in general, which is that I don't think, I think my data server is just, is not doing that great. I wonder if it's the data server. So we may need to do something. Uh, is it that you're just blocking on the network? So I'm not blocking on the network. You'll notice that I just use awaits everywhere. Uh, and I just, I, I literally just do this, right? I just have this on message. So only when I'm called, do I actually do something? And so is it the local, is it, is it local network that's doing something? Right? What is it? I don't know. Right? That's always the hard part I have with it. Maybe it's the eight equals D. No, that's the perfect equation. Hey, a register. Welcome thank you for the Costco. five gifted subs followed by the tier one brand new. So, I mean, I guess what we could do for the sake of doing it is that we could go here and we could just have, the problem is, is I did want like some, I did want some amount of like, I want this to, I wanted it to at least like write in a way that, that makes sense where it, it, it gives up the writing so that writing can be done in a separate area so I can get a bunch of stuff writing to it at once. You know what I mean? Uh, so let's go like that. I guess we can go like this. Res is an HTTP. Um, what is res? It's a... Welcome to Costco. I love you. It's a server response. Okay, so it's HTTP server response uh, incoming uh, HTTP incoming message. Yeah, baby. All right, so let's go like that. Let's go a little right on this bad boy. Let's write that res. And let's go like this. Uh, let's return. I think this is not going to be good. I think I'm going to end up... I, I think I'm going to end up having a lot more crap happen here. I was just hoping to avoid... Uh, oh, I can't write. Uh, let's just go like this. There we go. Beautiful. And so now I can just go await. Oh, and we can just do this now. Does that sound good? Starting to watch you as a college student, and now I know, let's see, and now I'm at work as a software engineer watching you. Nice. Well, thank you. Roasted DB. Thank you. Roast DB. Echo. All of this. XXD RP. I don't know what that does, and I don't know what XXD does. It sounds dangerous. Ask me the meat and give it to me at all. I don't even know what it does. Creates a hex up of a given file or standard input. Okay. What's your option? It's a hex dump. Oh, it's a hex dump. It's safe. I don't know. The problem is, is sometimes people don't make things safe. Okay. I don't know what it means. Okay. What what you got? What you got for me? Welcome to Costco. I love you. Why you gotta be like that, huh? Why you gotta come in here? Why you gotta come in here and just drop it on me like that? It hurts a little bit. El Quinimi, thank you for the five gifted community subs. And Theo, hey, Theo. Oh, tier three, what the? Shit. Theo. Breath of the Wild. Let's go. Are you gonna reach, are you gonna change your name to Tears of the Kingdom? Uh, but hey, Theo, thank you very much. Appreciate that. El Quinimi. Yeah, I've never said your name right. Not planning on to it now. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. St. Peter, how you doing? It's been a while. If only Zelda was a girl. If only. A year of tier three. Has it really been a year? Theo, I have two questions for you. Why would you do that? Two. Thank you. Uh, shout out. Well, let's, uh, you know, let's give Theo a little shout out. I don't know if you know this, but Theo also streams on Twitch. Theo, how's the, how's the pussy? Feeling better?
The pussycat. Theo, Theo has a sick pussycat. He's doing good. He's currently sitting in the shower, drinking water off the floor. Okay, okay, good. I'm more stressed than him. Okay, okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. That was the craziest thing I've ever heard you say. <laughs> I'm over here being concerned for an individual, and y'all y'all are over there just being de just degenerates. Just degenerates. Disgusting. Just... Uh, I'm over here inquiring. I mean, Theo, he lamented it on Twitter. Of course, I'm going to ask him questions. Now, ask him to show us. The, yeah, well, he shows you on stream. Uh, Tuxman, thank you very Welcome much. I appreciate Costco. that. Uh, nice dad you. jokes there. <laughs> F Twitter. F Twitter. Uh, it was the craziest thing. Okay, I, I, I can see that. I can, I can understand that. I just got really into the joke. I thought it was a good joke. All right, so I don't think this is actually going to do anything better for us here. Uh, but let's try it out anyways. There we go. We got that thing up and running. So let's just try this thing. I I don't think this thing is going to actually do anything for us. And let's go like... Oh, oh come on. Uh, node, do this. Let's do that. Okay. There we go. Hey, this is cool, though. We are getting partial messages now, which is kind of what I, I mean. In some sense, I wanted some partial messages. I think this is probably good to do partial messages. You know what I mean? Because now I kind of have to like parse them out. Let's just parse out these sons of bitches. You know what I mean? Uh, let's go like this. Um, let's go. Oh, crap. How do we want to do this? How do we want to do this? Because we kind of want something. I want to be able to just take something, hand it, a re hand it a result, and have it just call me every single time a new line comes. I really liked iterator pattern. I like pull pattern. But the problem is, is this is a very push start. So it has this really odd... You know what I mean? Uh, hand me any result, baby. I'll hand you any result. You just, just hand me a, a YouTube video. Just like, yo, bro, here's a YouTube video. Thanks for the Bob and Brad ball thing. And we're done. Okay. Anywho. <laughs> thank you. Uh, thank you for that. Oh, hell nah. It's just on stream. I feel like if I react, uh, Bob, uh, Bob, and, uh, Bob and Brad are great. Uh, the problem is, is that I don't, I don't want them to tell me that sitting on a ball is not good because it makes my back feel good. Okay. Because I get like a nice firm erection all day long while sitting on a ball. And I feel like if you're just not having that. If you're not f firmly erect the entire day, honestly, it's just it just means you're not doing a good job. You know what I mean? Peak firmness, yeah. Yeah. Spine left the chat. Erection all day long, yeah. Yeah, all day long. Every time I say anything, you know what I think about? Is I think about Anna Codes becoming slightly more disappointed in me. Anna, I appreciate you. Okay. I do. Really subtle reference there. Yeah, it's, it's spinal. Just like Mike Tyson. Spinal. Uh, all right. So I guess what we're going to have to do now is let's do this. Now, I know you script kitties hate classes. Um, uh, fuck off. I don't care. Um, all right. Let's do this one. Uh, private. Uh, previous. We're going to just have this thing as a buffer array. And we're gonna go like this. Oh, you could just you could just have a function return a function that that has a ra that has a closure over this stuff, and then you just call it, and sometimes it returns it. It's the same shit, okay? It's just the same shit every day. Oh, okay, here we go. It's a function. Uh, lines. Oh, lines. Oh, previous. Oh, const. Previous is a buffer array. Return function. Yeah. Fuck yeah. I'm functional bros. Bros. I'm so function functional. But I'm, I'm a functional bro. Look at this. It's it's to I'm totally not making a class. Okay, this is not a class. Okay, sure, there's a property and a closure and a way to look it up. And sure I create the function every time I execute the function. Um, that's totally cool because you know, why would you want to create a function once? When you could create the function every time. You know what I mean? Like you want to create the function every time. Because that way it's pure. Because if you created a function twice. 
it's pure, but if it's once, it's not pure, do you even lift? Do you even function? The same shit. Guys, this is literally the same thing with slightly less efficient looking up. That is literally it. Th that's the only difference between these two is that this just slightly isn't as good. And every time you call it, you create more memory. Okay, there's like, it's, you're not winning. You're not winning, okay? You're just writing functions. I'll do it for you guys. Because you guys are a bunch of dummies. Um, all right, anyways. Uh, there is a weird class keyword. It's ugly. Is that is that it? No, you're just you're just a dummy. That's all it is. Okay, anyways. So let's go like this. If let's go like this, const new line equals uh there we go. Thank you. That's what I was expecting. Buff dot index of char new line. No, not equals okay, interesting. Uh let's return back out a boofer or undefined. We're gonna return out a boofer, boys. Boys, we're returning out a boofer. Uh, undefined. There we go. All right. So we're oh push. Yep, that's good enough. There we go. Else we hit this new line, and so now we need to do it again. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, we're gonna go boofing, boys. Boys, we're going boofing. Um, let's go like this. Uh, let's go like this. Uh, boof equals boof. There we go. We got a reassignable version now. We got our boofer. Okay, let's go like this. Boof. Let's go while. Ooh, let's do while. Do while for the boys. You know what I mean? Everyone's always everyone's always into this non-do while. They don't even know what they're doing, okay? This is where we are at. Actually, I can't use a do while, okay? I can't use a do while. It just don't work. And let's get rid of boof, okay? We don't need the boof around here. Okay, let's go like this. Let's start equals zero. Let's have uh, index equals zero. Let's go like this while index is no that's not it let's do something way nastier than that let's get nasty on these boys uh equals buff index yeah let's get so nasty on them there we go we're getting nasty okay we're doing a little bit of parsing if you can't handle parsing i understand you know a lot of people can't handle parsing i get it it's uh you know it's it's always it's an ugly sport here all right so now that we got that if index equals this what we're going to want to do is we're actually going to want to take the previous one now we're going to go like this if uh previous uh, length is greater than zero, even though you could just search that. So now you get into this really funny world. See, this is one of the problems about this is that I should just be returning an array of buffers. I don't really want to return an array of buffers. I hate creating memory, but we're going to have to. Okay, we're just going to have to. I don't want to. There we go. And I guess we can just make this easy and just do that. I don't like it, but that's what we're going to do. Okay. So if length is greater than that, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to slice this one. We're going to want to concat previous into a line. Previous equals nothing. A yield. Huh. Interesting. Okay. I like what's happening here. I like what's happening here. Uh, we're going to go like this. Uh, const out equals that. Boom. It's a it's a boofer array. You may have heard of a boomer array. Uh, out push line. Return out. There we go. We're just going to keep on doing this else we just need to go out push line boom yeah 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 wait slice Ooh, we don't want to use slice we want to use sub array baby i mean i'd prefer to use actually i do prefer to use slice slice is considered dangerous right uh i can't believe they're deprecating it is there a better way to do this oh it, it, wait sub array is actually this right the sub array is the new version of this right it doesn't copy, right? It returns a new buffer that references the same memory. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so subarray is the replacement of slice. I forgot about that. I forgot about that. Um, looks like 42's project get next line. Yeah, it's everybody's project. It's everybody's get next line. Splices and uh, ECMA really said that's enough slices. Yeah. So Theo, you know, you know the reason why they do that, right? It's so it's not ECMA. It's not ECMA that did this. It's Node because Node, uh, Node fucked up. No, no genuinely made an oopsie daisy. And the reason why is actually pretty straightforward. Uh, so what ended up happening is that Node decided one day they're going to make this class called Buffer. Okay. So uh, it's called Buffer, right? So Buffer alloc uh, zero, right? So we have this, we have a, we have a buff. Actually, let's, let's, let's change that. I just realized that sucks here. I'm going to leave just so I can reuse the word boofer. All right. So here we go. Four. So we have four bytes right here. It's called a uh, boofer, right? So I'm going to go like this. A boof uh zero equals 69 nice okay so let's check out our boofer 
uh boof okay so there we go we got 69 right there looking pretty good right now if you go like this if you go const uh boofer equals boof dot slice what's going to happen here well it actually creates a shallow copy of it so if i go boofer uh one equals uh 255 and we do this you'll notice that boom i just altered boof not boofer and you're thinking well that's not a big deal right well it's not a big deal until they decided to do one small thing uh here we go let's just do this const uh uint equals new uint 8 array and let's make this thing four big and go uint uh zero equals 69 and then let's go like this uint uint er equals uint slice zero okay uint er one equals 255 now go uint you'll notice it didn't do it with slice and you're thinking okay what where where is this going okay buffer totally makes a shallow copy uint data array doesn't what's the deal well here's the problem uh boof instance of uint8 array that's where you fucked up that's where it all went wrong now why is that dangerous well it's actually quite simple which means when you jump over here and you go like this, uh, function, uh, do something, right? Uh, and it takes in a buff that's a uint8 array. Guess what? And it returns out, say, a new uint8 array. It's going to go like this, return uh, buff.slice1, right? And so now if I have a const buffer equals a buffer.alloc, uh, apparently I'm allocating a lot of memory here, and I go like this, do something, something, buffer, Look at that. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You didn't, re you didn't realize it. You just got dunked on. You're dead. You're dead. Right? So that, that's where it really gets dangerous is what Node accidentally did. Yeah, Node, Node made an oopsie-daisy. Uh, boof backwards. Foob. Uh, anyways, there you go. This is why we love JS. I know. So there you go. Just so you guys know, a lot of people don't know these fun facts. And so I like to give you some fun facts. You know what I mean? It's fun facts. Fun facts about knowing a language fairly deeply. Fair on the deep scale. I'll give you a little secret, though. Just a little secret. Every language sucks. I hate to tell you this, but every language sucks. You know what I mean? How deep? Mid shaft. Every language sucks. I hate to tell you this. Other than C sharp. Actually, C sharp probably sucks the biggest shaft out of all of them. That's the multi billion dollar C uh, Microsoft shaft, of course. HTML probably being the best programming language ever. You know what I mean? I don't understand why you have to close over previous. Well, you should have. Uh, as someone starting with C Sharp, I agree. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Machine learning. Uh, HTML is actually uh, uh, is, is pronounced Hitmel. Hitmel and uh, Hatapi. Hitmel and Hatapi. You transfer Hitmel over Hatapi. Everyone knows that. HTML makes me really... Uh, Hitmel makes it really hard to leak memory. It's true. Anyways, there you go. I hope everyone appreciated their daily lesson of shut the hell up. Um, now, please, can we go back to where you guys were telling me all about how amazing life is? All right. Anyways, let's see. If, uh, let's see, start equals IDX. If start, if, uh, if start is less than boof.length, um, previous, uh previous push this guy there we go beautiful all right there we go so there we go we got this nice little lines thing um i'm gonna go write some odin yeah it, html html uh hitmo is pronounced the way it is said in the same way c sharp uh do what he said it does <laughs> what what pronounce hava scripty yeah oh 
anyways, let's keep on going. Everyone ready? All right, so there we go. We created this nice little lines function because why would I have That's my impersonation of you guys. All right, so we're going to go like this. Um, uh, const lines equals, bring it in here, lines. Oh, yeah, I got to do so much more memory. Uh, produce lines, baby. I like that name, okay? And we're going to go like this. Const out equals produce lines. Let's do it. Give them the D. Give them the little D. Rename it to the big D. Yes, give them the big D. All right. Now that we got that one, we're going to be able to do this one. And we're going to go like this. For uh, const. Yeah, yeah, that, that, yeah, that one. There we go. Push. Uh, let's see. Data dot push. Wait. Data dot push. Yeah. 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 Console dot error. Whoa. What the fuck, Richard? There we go. And let's kill that guy. Let's start that guy. Let's do this one. Unterminated string. Why? Porque Maria. How did I? Oh. T S C. Forgot to build. Uh. Do that one. A plus impersonation of chat. No problem. Typical Richard. Okay. This song is such a banger. Are you guys are you guys banging with me right now? This is like my programming song. I, I kid you not. When you guys aren't on here, I sometimes listen to this specific song on repeat. I don't know what it is. Thank you, low level learning. Bang me daddy. People, learn how to use core utils, okay? It's important to learn how to use core utils because you can do sweet stuff like that, okay? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Makes you feel all hot and bothered on the inside. I'm a little skeptical that the memory's not changing, though. Idle. Okay, we've done something wrong. Damn. I was right on that. I was... Oh, crap. Oh, crap. It's too fast. I can't stop it. I can't stop it. I can't stop it. Stopped it. Uh, Welcome to Costco. Anyways, okay, so I love you. what song is this? I have no idea. All right. So what happened here? What did we do wrong? Wait. That looks right, isn't it? I'm so confused. Ah, oh, crap! I did it again! What?! Where is it? Where is it? Oh, I forgot to build it. I would expect it to be done by now. I'd expect it. It's only 100,000 objects. Oh, no. Here, let's start off with 1,000 objects. Okay, because something's gone clearly wrong here. Clearly, I've done something wrong. Why isn't it working? Porque Maria. All right, hold on.
And see, I'd expected it to say end by now. I'd expect end to happen, you know what I mean? All right, I got one more. I got one more thing to do. Hold on. There's one more thing I need to look at. Okay. All right, so that should reset that one. That should push it. That should concat it. That should reset it. That should do that. Okay, so that like that does look correct. I'm thinking that looks correct. I'm a little bit skeptical of this part, but whatever. Uh, console.log uh, const count equals zero. Let's go like this. Count uh, and let's go data.length. Yeah. Oh, you can't assign count, can you? Wait, porque? What did I just say? Nice, look at that. There was five, it was called 105 times. Wait, wait why is end not happening? <gasps> you stupid person! <laughs> called it, dumbass. Called it, dumbass. Nine X Dev, strong nine X vibes going on right here. All right, uh, let's. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's get rid of that thing. We don't need that thing. We do need a what the hell, Richard? That seems good. Okay, so this thing should be producing. Okay. Um, don't do that. I should do something with this so that Netflix can't get rid of it. You know what I mean? I feel like Netflix shouldn't. I or Netflix. I feel a. Oh my goodness, uh, event of Welcome events. to Costco. I love you. Um, what should I do? What is this thing? What is the, what is this guy? It's a thing of events, so what is this thing? It should be an event. And there should be at least type, right? Why are you saying there's no type? There should be at least type. Why are you doing that? Um, let's go up to here. Right? It should be one of these ones, which uh, this should contain either type, 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 or type. Why? Why is it not doing that? Why Why? Co why come no work? Why come no work? All right. Uh, oh, I know why, because I'm a dummy. I am a dummy. It's, it's this one. There we go. Uh, not really sure what to do with I just don't want it to get rid of that value. You know what I mean? I want that value to remain around. I don't know what to do with this. We'll have to think about what to do with this thing. To do, make sure V8 isn't too smart. You know what I mean? V8's always really smart. You got to be very careful on that one. You know what I mean? V8's much smarter than you think it is. All right, so there, okay, I still have end. Come on. All right, there we go. All right. Let's get rid of that. Ah, let's get rid of that thing. Uh, I hate tomatoes personally. Really? What happens if they're lightly salted? Sir? A little light, light salting? Have you considered that for tomato usage? Vim smarter than Node.js. Okay, tomatoes suck. Okay, the tomatoes don't suck. All right. Okay, better, be better, L much less idle time now. Let's see if we can squeak in one more, huh? I, I really don't want to have to, I think I'm going to have to write my server. I think I'm going to have to write my server in Rust. You know what I mean? Auto. What up, baby? I literally just got done saying, I think I have to write my server in Rust, and we all know Auto it loves Rust. Okay, Otto. Hey, go follow Otto. I don't know if you know this. If you don't know anything about Otto, I'll tell you this much. Good programmer, and during his streams, he has this person that's continuously cutting 
soap, and I watched it for a half an hour this morning. My entire one-on-one with my boss, I spent watching soap get cut. And for the first five minutes, I was like, this is stupid. Who, would, who, who puts cut and soap on a stream? 30 minutes into it, I'm like, this is so cool. Who doesn't watch cut and soap on a stream? You know what I mean? Change my mind. Oh, thank you, DHZ. I appreciate that. I love you. Clearly a genius. Clearly smarter than me. Okay? Clearly smarter than me. Hey, for all those that don't know what we're doing, we're doing a little performance testing. Uh, I have one worry. I worry a little bit that my server is not fast enough. Uh, and so I'm just I'm I'm producing events. I'm gonna try I'm gonna try adding two more um, keeping it hards, and I'm really hoping that this should give me enough speed and juice to you know give to make ah to make me all the way to the end. You know what I mean? I wanna I, I have you ever want have you ever have you ever just have you ever tried to have you ever did you, did you ever have you ever did you ever do that? Have you ever tried? When have you have you ever wanted to use note that you could use note so bad you could you could you would want him to do you anything so you could do anything? All right, let's find out. Biden. <laughs> I can't believe that is even a joke possible. Uh, all right. Anyways. Let's keep on going. Okay, there we go. So now we're stacked. Okay, so we got very little idle time now. Okay, so we're looking better. We're not so idle as we once were before. So let's go like this. Let's look up idle. What do we got? We got a lot of idle time in here, but it may not actually be all that much. Hold on, let me just zoom forward. You know, sometimes idle time is uh, deceiving. You know what I mean? Just because there's a lot of events. What are we looking at? So we got an aggregated uh, aggregated total time of 4.7 seconds out of how much time? Out of uh, 25 uh, seconds. Okay, pretty good. Uh, how about uh, garbage collection? We got a lot of garbage collection. Okay. How are we looking here? Oh, we're spending a lot of time. Uh, about a second in garbage collection time. Okay. So that's actually a pretty big hindrance here, right? So that's about 4% of our server time is spent picking up shit right so that kind of sucks right uh, and uh codes i regularly watch that video such positive vibes right it sucks huh one millisecond no 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 i looked at uh lo don't look at th don't look at this time look at this time aggregated self time right that's the one you want to look at okay that's the one you want to be looking at you know what i mean oh my goodness nintron coming in with the tip have you ever had a dream that you um you had your you you could you'll do you you wants you you could do so you you'll do you could you you want you want him to do you so much you could do anything absolutely i have you know it's every red-blooded american has had that dream okay i remember when that speech was originally delivered and i personally never thought i could relate with anything anyone has ever said in my entire lifetime but it turns out you can all right, so now that we got that, let's jump in here. Let's kill this thing out. Let's jump down this inspect. Go to here. By the way, thank you, Nintron. Let's do that. Actually, let's jump here. Uh, P grep node. Let's make sure this is what I think it is. Yeah, that's the one. Okay. Uh, let's see. VMRSS. Boom. All right. So we're just going to watch its memory. Let's just look at its memory. Okay, this is just what it's doing. This is just what it's doing. Okay, so now I had this plan. Are you ready for Welcome my to plan? Costco. So this I is my you. plan is that again, garbage that does not stay long does not need as much memory. Are you ready for my optimization that I want to take? I've been planning to get to here this entire time just to watch this happen. And now we gotta do it, okay? And we got the perfect song. We got the perfect song to get this bad boy going on, okay? So we're going to take that one. We're going to go here. We're going to paste this down here, and we're going to go strategy two. And you know what we're going to have come out of here? We're not going to do a promise of event because that's a bunch of bullshit. We're going to actually have this. We're going to have the following. Are you ready for what we're going to do? We're actually going to have an array boofer, okay? We're going to make an array of array boofers. Now, this is going to be pretty magical, but really what I could also do is I could also do this. I could also do an array boofer straight up one big ass array boofer are you guys ready for this this is kind of my idea to save on memory and make it happen okay 
but we're gonna keep it we're gonna keep it right here for now Okay, we're gonna keep it right here for now, even though I wouldn't actually have to. So with what I'm building, I'm building a CSV generator. And so actually I could get away with having one gigantic array. I Welcome could, to Costco. I very well I could. You. Now that's the cool part is I could actually get away with doing this. Now I think that that's gonna be the magical part. So let's make one small adjustment. I'm gonna make it a little bit closer to what I'm actually doing. Are you ready for this? Woo! All right, so let's go like this. I'm gonna pass an I, okay? You know why? Because we're going to make one update to all these, okay? Uh, ID, number, let's go. Here's one of the benefits of building a system when you build a system for yourself is this right here, okay? This is very, very important to do, okay? Um, let's go like this. All right, I'm, I'm happy all you guys feel the jams. Are you guys feeling the jams? How do you make watching coding feel like a sporting event? I don't know, but I'm into it, Elysium. We're getting into it, okay? All right, so now that we have this, we're gonna have that, and we're gonna jump over here, and we're gonna go like this, ID, and we're gonna go over here, and we go ID, we're gonna have a little number, we're gonna plumb that shit clean through, jump back here, and now let's try something a little bit different. I guess the first thing we need to do is we need to rerun this one, Richard of York. And we're going to jump down here. Let's do that. Let's jump over here. Let's actually go back in here and let's run another one. Go here and regrep this bad boy. And so I did add an ID, which theoretically means it is going to be using more memory than it was. It's going to have at least one more heap pointer, a shmi. But, uh, you know, let's see what happens. Oh, gosh, we're running out of the song. I'm not ready for the song to end. I'm not ready for the song to end. I'm not ready. I'm not ready for the song to end. Okay, as you can see, garbage collection is just hitting it all the time. We're going fast. We're going good. Imagine if somebody who doesn't know coding sees this. Yeah, well, currently I am in just chatting, so the chance of that happening is exponentially high. I do want to say, hey, Mojo, thank you for that brand new Twitch Prime. And Foundoyalius, thank you. I have a confession. I mainly watch you on YouTube. Goodbye. Love you, baby. Thank you. Automated, I hope that you had a good uh, stream. Wrong category, DH said. Thank you for the three months tier one. Giving it off to dirgeable. But that by the way, that's three Welcome months dirgeable. To I love you. Killico, thank you very much. I hope you guys are ready. I have you guys firmly sitting up, ready to rock. Let's go. And Hansel. Welcome to Costco. Cancel. I love you. What a name, Hansel Cancel. Thank you. Killico. Oh! Oh, it did it! Oh, he did it! The, the subscribe by the fall! Oh my goodness, I love to see it. You gotta love to see it. It's happened twice this stream. It is the best. It is the best that possibly has ever happened. Let's go. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready to get back into it. I'm ready to, you know, the no pants, no dance. Here we go. So, let's take this off. Let's go here. Let's go like this. And we're gonna try something that's pretty wild. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. We already know the maximum possible size of any of our items, right? You know this. You know this. You know this, okay? That means we gotta go like this. Const a buffer equals new array buffer. And I'm just simply gonna make this thing 1024 by a 1024 by uh, 20. We're gonna make 20 megabyte buffer, okay? That should be big enough to fit all the actual data I'm ever gonna have to be concerned about. And so I think this is good enough for us to make it happen. You know what I'm talking about? All right, here we go. All right, so now that we have that, we're going to have the exact same thing right here. We're going to produce lines. When we produce a line, see, again, when you're using functions that use functions, it's really hard to be able to reuse the functions. You know what I mean? See, the thing is, is right here, let's just say we ended our previous one in a weird state, and so therefore we're not really quite able to reuse this, right? So if I would have made this a class as opposed to a function that produces a function that we did, I'd be able to call reset on it, clear out all previous state, and then be able to do do it again or i have to do something stupid like this where I, I send a a secret message in here to do that and so that means i can't conserve memory right it's a name of things okay does anyone know the name of the song i don't know the name of the song it's miss monique podcast number 12 at the very end 56 minutes into the podcast okay so we're going to produce a line and when you get a boofer clean out of this now here's my theory again if you if it, it it is okay in javascript to produce a bit of memory right some memory look at that memory okay we got the event we got the event it is okay so there Welcome we go Actually, i'm just gonna do that in here i love you all right so now that we've got the event we're gonna have to do something that's a little bit 
salacious. Are you ready for this? Uh, where are you? This is strategy one. Get the hell out of strategy one. Get the hell out of strategy one. Go down to strategy two. All right, let's do a little view. All right, there we go. So we got the view. Let's go in here and let's go like this. Const, JSON, do that. Yep, there we go. So now that we got the view, Welcome to we Costco. Can take this JSON and you. convert it and write it into our boofer, okay? And so we're going to go like this. Uh, let index equals zero. We really should be using a class for this because this is obviously way, way better to reuse this as opposed to produce it. You know what I'm talking about? But whatever. We don't have time for this. Gosh dang it. We're not going to redo this. Okay. It's going to be interesting because it's going to cause large spikes in our memory usage. But we might end up using less memory overall. This obviously doesn't quite represent the system that I'm doing. So you know what I mean? I automatically lose, but I guess I, since we're not doing that, since I, I'm going to be more fair to the system we're creating here, and I'm just going to drag it down to one megabyte. That should be good enough. And let's not use a U int eight array. Let's use a U thirty two. Welcome array. to Costco. Okay. Hey, thank you very much. I appreciate that. You, you know what I'm talking about, baby. Field. You know what I'm talking about. Luca Mendodor. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. And Clamier, thank you for the brand new boofer. Hell yeah, but, brother. Using a font that is neither sans nor serif. It has glyphs with serif and without. Unacceptable. Suck on it. Hey, Chungus Among Us. Uh, Congo Com Sucrehoist. Thank you for the brand new tier one. Let's go. Ember, I love it. Love everything you're doing. Two months. Thank you. Appreciate that. Thank you for all those follows. And Luca, again, thank you for the sub. Okay, so now that we have that, we're going to have to do something that's kind of going to suck, okay? So we have this, which actually is as event. Okay, this kind of sucks, but are you ready for this one? We're going to create something that takes one of these events, and we're going to write it into the buffer, okay? Into the boofer. Directly into the boofer. Are you ready for this? All right, so let's go like this. So let's go into the event and let's go like this export function right into a boofer. Right? And we're going to have this. We're going to have our boofer itself, which is going to be a uint32 uh, array, followed Welcome by an offset, which is going to be you. a number. Okay? And then it's going to return back out a number. This is going to be our new offset. Okay? We're, this is just like, now we're just protocoling. Okay? This is like this is like some shitty version of protobufs going in here. Actually, it's probably like a slightly better version of protobufs. Never mind. Don't even worry about it. Because we can take an optimization. If you know everything you're storing is a number, you can optimize that. You know what I'm talking about? You can optimize for what you're doing, which I think is the 600 IQ play here, is instead of uh, instead of trying to make a general solution, make a specific solution when you have a memory problem. I'm ready for something that will suck a suck a little bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. We need more music. We need more intensity. We need more speed. There we go. Thank you for the speed. Uh, do I have, I think I have, some, do I have meetings today? I'm totally not paying attention at all, and I haven't peed in a while, and I feel like I can, I can commit to this lifestyle. Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah, brother. All right. All right, I gotta pee. I gotta pee. It's been this entire stream, and I haven't done it. I gotta pee. I gotta be right back. I gotta pee. I'll be right back. Thank you, UJ! UJ! Thank you! Yes, my beautiful wife. Oh, I put you on hold. Hold on. Oh, I hung up on you. What am I? What what am I? A child? Now now we're in this weird game where I'm calling her and she's trying to call me. 
Hey, what up, baby? Okay. Oh, code? You need a code? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 let's go. <laughs> All right. What's the what's the way to type this so that it's gonna be one of these key sets, whatever. Ah, uh, gosh, I know there's a good way to type this. I always suck at typing this. I always hate typing this so much. What's the way to type this that it makes sense, right? It's like type keys is going to be, um, you know, like uh, event one type of key one, event two type of keys two, right? Uh, key types, right? And then we have something that's like a keys, which is going to be a key, uh, a key types, right? And then we go in here and we go, uh, event one keys. Yep. Oopsies. Right. Is this the way you do it? Right. Key types. You do one of those and you go const. Uh, keys equals that as const. Let's go. And then, of course, get rid of these. And so now I should be able to just go like this. Keys. I should be able to go like this. Uh, const keys equals uh, keys. I mean, technically, I can do that. It's the same thing, right? So we get the right thing. So it's able to identify the right thing, which is what I wanted it to do. Mod check, please ban Nightshade, dude. Why, Beast Co.? What do you do? Eliano. Elazion. I'm leaving. You're welcome. Okay, bye, Nightshade, dude. Beast Code's just getting... He's getting His head's getting a little big because he knows we're going to grab a delicious lunch here within the week. And so he's already planning on taking me out to Stella's. All right, let's go. All right, so we got ourselves. We got the keys. We can now walk the event. The reason why I wanted to do this, so this automatically gives you the correct typing because if I move it to here and then go into keys, I don't think we get the... See, our typing's all effed up, right? Our typing's all effed up when you do that. But if you go like that, the typing is all fantastic. You know what I mean? Why don't I have the VODs enabled? The VODs are enabled. Yeah, I know exactly. Bisco, you know what I'm talking about. You can go like this, VODs. You can go like this, add com, VODs. Uh, YouTube.com, uh, YouTube.com. Ooh, get careful. It's going to turn into tubgirl.com. Uh, the Vim Agen. There we go. I just started this channel last week. We're looking thick. Look at that. We got a look at that. I got I got I still have two streams I need to upload or start. I'm behind a little bit on it. Uh, there we go. There we go. Uh, do you love this game? The new Casey. Oh, really? Yeah, so is Casey wants to come on to the channel and do a react with me. You guys got to pick out the perfect article or the perfect video that he can react to with me co-reacting to a blog or a video. I think it'd be so good because Casey is pretty awesome. All right. So there we go. So see, this doesn't quite work. Obviously, I can go like that. Right. And that works. But it's... It, Whatever. It just kind of, it's just stupid. You know what I mean? That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted something that, I just wish, I just wish this would work better. You know what I, I wish you could work backwards, right? You can't work backwards. Uh, event type, whatever. And then I can go like this. Um, 
I can go, uh, oh, let's see, because these are in the order I want them to be in. So I can go like this, for const key of keys, do that. And now I can take in here and I can go like this, boof, let's see, uh, boof offset equals event key. There we go. So this is actually looking really good. So this is precisely what we wanted. Feels good, right? So now we're going to encode this thing. The worst part is now we have to just like, I have to just do this, right? I think I can write a function that's better, right? We could probably have some sort of function that's like encode that is a T that extends event uh, where event is a T, keys is a um, key of T, uh, boof is a UN32 array, offsets that, and we should be able to do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we should be able to do this, right? I think we can do this. Uh, oh, whoopsies. Uh, key of T, yeah. We got to do key of T, that, and it will go like this. I hate that I have to do this, but whatever. No, you lie to me! You lie to me! You lie to the forest! This is so effing great. Right? There you go. I'll just do that. As it. As that shit. How do you delete a word from your cursor to the semicolon? DT a semicolon. Uh, DT semicolon. Boo! DT semicolon. Boo! There we go, encode. This is looking good, so we're gonna do this. And so that means we should be able to do this. If I'm not mistaken, I should be able to go like this. Keys, uh, encode. Um, oh my goodness gracious. Yes, Bisco? Wait, what's happening? It's only happened once this stream. 30 times? I thought the problem is, is I put on I put on do not disturb and then I forget that it's on do not disturb and then All right, love you Bisco. Bye. Fine, Bisco. There you go. There you go. All right, so we got it. Bam. Uh and we'll go like this as a uh, key of event. Let's see event. Oh, come on. That is so good. That is so effing good. Why are you lying to me? Dang it. I don't know how to do this one pot. I don't know how to do this one well. You know what I mean? They should be the same thing because these two are keyed off each other. So this is the one thing I don't know how to do well yet in TypeScript. Like how to make this thing work. You know what I mean? How do you make this thing work? That I don't know how to do. Return offset. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got that. Don't worry, Robin. I'd get that. I still don't know. How, I gotta. I gotta increase Tokyo. I need to increase my uh, ability with TypeScript for sure to be able to solve these kind of things. Because I find that I do this all the time, and I don't quite know how to make that work. You know what I mean? Um, hey, it's okay, Bisco. I get it. So, shoot. Right? It sucks, right? It sucks. I wish I knew what to do here. Union of values of those five different arrays. Well, it's not just that I have a union of those values. That's not the problem. I need to be discriminated, type discriminated. I'm providing the type, and then I'm also passing that same event that I got the type from into here, but the keys aren't quite right. Like, obviously, I could go like this, right? If type equals event one, right? I could then go, um, I could go keys, uh, what's it called? E uh, event type. I think this should work. No, that doesn't work, really. It doesn't work. Okay, I think that's right. Oh, that's that. Ooh, that's not the one I wanted. I wanted keys, capital K keys. I want capital K keys. Um, yeah, see, it's still confused. Kind of bullshit. 
I mean, type is obviously exactly what it is. It's event one, which means event one, because this thing is defined that right here, that event one gets type of one keys, right? And the funny part is if I take that and I go like this, const uh, keys do that, it can identify the correct one. But then when I go in here and I go keys, it can't relate these two together. And that's the problem. It's because I constrain the generics right here in that way. It can't figure it out on the other side, which is kind of, you know, it is what it is because it, it doesn't understand what's going on here, right? So I could go like this. Um, I think that might work. No, ugh, that should kind of work. I feel like that should work. Whatever. But the encoded function has a big union of uh, the keys array. It doesn't technically, it, it, has, it has keys of T as an array. Anyways, doesn't really matter. This is good enough. I mean, I know this is right. I just don't know how to express that yet. I don't know how to express that yet. When I figure out how to express this, it'll be fantastic. I don't know how to express it yet. Oh, that's I'm sweating, Lithium. Thank you very much for the 20 gifted subs, Lithium. Now I sweat for you. Let me sweat for you, Daddy. I appreciate that. Uh, chats, let's spam it. Uh, get Casey uh, reacting to functional JS. Well, we need a new thing. Hey, Anna. Hey, Bisco. I don't know what's going on here. Bisco, I can't unsee it after you told me. What? What? Unsee what? Now I can't stop thinking about it. What happened? What did I miss? Bisco, what the hell did you say? Bisco, what the hell? Anna goes, I have tried. I've even talked to... Oh, oh, you're talking about the... Uh, you're talking about the, uh, yeah, I know. Palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy, fingers are fast. You like how fast that is? Bam. 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 Huh. You got to be fast, people, okay? You want to you wanna, you wanna be able to move, you know what I mean? Okay. Mom spaghetti. Uh, Primogen, uh, TS has a hard time as associating keys with their values. Yeah, I know. I, I'm going to have to figure it out. I, I'm sure I'll take some time to try to figure it out. I just need to do it a couple times. Okay, here we go. All right, so this is all looking good. So now we have an encoding algorithm, an encoding algorithm, and we'll go like this. Uh, uh, IDX equals encode, and no, not punny encode, not query string encode. What the hell do I call it? Right and boof. <laughs> Can't forget the things that I say. Uh, what do we call this thing? We need the event, uh, JSON. We need, what do we need next? We need the boof. Um, what is my boof? I need my view. Uh, whoa, whoa, ho, whoa. Ho. What else? We need our offset? Really? That's what we need? Is there nothing else? All right, so this should write everything in there. We should be able to instantly drop the JSON produced, and we're only keeping it as big as this. So I'm curious if this just makes it smaller. Like, are we containing the same information while keeping it smaller? That's what she always wanted. Just saying. Just saying. Did I call it boofer? Please tell me I called it boofer. I didn't even call it boofer. I am pathetic. All right, so we're just writing it in. But we're, we are doing one thing wrong here, which is that I need to have a width. Right, I need a width because in my real one, I'll know the exact width. And let's see, in this one, we could, you know, effectively guess the exact same width. So there will be some wasted data here. Like we could encode what type it is to have a tighter encoding, but what I'm doing, you can't do that. I need every single spot to be something. So this one, we could go from, let's see, what is this? Uh, 23 to uh, 44, so 22 items in here. All right, so we could just go like this. IDX plus equals 22, and we're not, we're just going to ignore it. So we're just going to keep it as a square, right? There's 22 items at max in every single column. So think of a CSV, right? So technically, I'd have like 40 items in the CSV, and I would just like, you know, walk it straight down. All right, there we go. This is looking good. Get that. Get the hell out of there. All right. So I'm curious if strategy two works out at all. Right? Does strategy two work at all? We need some way to also validate that I'm doing anything right. You know what I mean? 
All right, so look at that. Interesting. This is using a lot more memory. I would, I would assume that it would be able to not use nearly as much memory. Well, look at that. Well, that is shitty. I was hoping that the garbage collection would drop things super fast since they only live for a single function lifetime. That's what I was hoping to see. Ugh, that is so effing disappointing. All right, so let's do this and go uh, inspect. Let's see what's happening here because I'm actually curious. Can I re-record? Does this work? Where you, Can you just... Right. Myth busted. I know, but I... Damn. I wonder why. You know what I mean? I know I'm still returning the offset from the loop. Whatever, right? Could have something to do with transpilation? No, I don't think so. I, I'm curious what's happening. Well, there, there's, there's, there's potential other issues that are going on here. Oh, damn it. Here. That's definitely annoying. Oh, my goodness. Just let me type. Oh, my goodness. I can't type the letter J. Oh, my goodness. Uh, can I... Dude, what is this? What is the is this real? Is this a real save screen? CPU one. That's all we're doing. Apparently, that's a real one. Ah! Okay, we're back in. Yeah, this is shitty. So I don't like this. I really don't like this. The memory is always going up. I'm curious if it goes up forever. I'm going to go like that. Which is funny. This number is claiming that it's like all low and stuff. You know, isn't it always funny that they're always like, look, it's not using that much memory. And then you go over here and you go, what? I wonder if, do I have a leak somewhere? Am I leaking? Girl, am I leaking? Girl? Am I leaking? It looks like I'm leaking. You know what I mean? All right, so I'm curious about this. Oh, interesting. You know what's kind of interesting here? It is... Uh, let's see. I, I, I'd i wonder if you could do a little... You could... Let's see. Uh, all right, so obviously this went on for a lot longer uh, time period. Oh, look at the difference, though. The garbage collection is significant. Okay, so theory one is correct. Theory one is correct. So, okay, 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 okay. We actually, okay, so with what's happening right now, we are actually making more requests than we were before. Is what I think is happening. Almost no GC is happening. Almost none. Instead... Something is happening. Now, the real question, it doesn't, uh, I'm not sure if GC is leaking. I think we're literally just hitting like a running point. I'd have to let this go because if it was leaking, it should be linearly growing at the same rate always. We're not quite linearly growing at the same rate. Okay. So this is good. So let's, let's drop this thing. Let's drop this thing and let's do something different here. Are you ready for this one? We're going to go like this. Uh, we're going to keep it hard now. We're going to go like this. Let count equals zero. And we're going to go like Welcome this. Welcome to Costco. I love you. If Maple Leaf was out here, I'd be like, hell yeah, Maple Leaf. You know, me and, Ma me and Mapes and Grapes would be just getting down on this. I don't got Mapes out, though. Uh, if count modulo 100 equals uh, zero, let's do this. Okay, let's go like this. Console.log. Help me, daddy. This totally sucks, okay? Um, actually, let's go like this. Let's do it every thousand. And let's go like this. Uh, let, let's see. Uh, const start equals uh, date dot... Ooh, is that a Dane? The name is Uhtred. I am Uhtred of Bebenbe. Is Uhtred's acting not the most annoying of all acting of all time? The name is Uhtred. The name is Uhtred. He is an honorable man. I just want to punch him every time he speaks. It's a great show. But Bisco, tell me that's not a great impersonation. Tell me that is not a great impersonation. Making fun of Indians? Dude, he's a Dane, you dummy. Love the show. Racism. Hey, 
Hey, baby, I'm a Dane too, okay? Or Norwegian. I'm, I'm one of them. One of them people up there. Racism. <laughs> that impression was spot on. It is spot on. Totally, though, was a uh, girl when he came up out of the water. Yeah, yeah. Hethelfell. He's a good kid. Hethelfell. Hethelfell. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Okay, 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 okay. All right, so let's go like this. Let's take a let's take a uh const uh points. Let's just do a really simple test, okay? A really simple test here. We're gonna go like this, points. And we're gonna go down here, and every time we get a hundred, we're gonna go like this. Points dot uh we're gonna go like this. Points um points dot push uh date dot now. And let's go like this. Okay. And then let's go like this. If uh points the length is greater than 10. Let's go like, uh, let's uh, break. Okay, we're gonna break from our hardness. And at the very end of all of this, is this a async function? Nice, baby. Oh my goodness, my wife can apparently get through do not disturb. Yes, darling? No, I didn't. Oh, how much is it? $100,000. Yep. I know, but we knew this was coming for, for months. I know, it's real now. We knew our well we knew our well was gonna cost a lot. Alright. I gotta let you go though, I love you. Yeah. Love you. Bye. All right, boys, the well did come in. We have the well fixed. We actually have running water as of yesterday, and it turns out to fix the well did take $83,000. $83,000. So we opened up a small loan against our house, and now we have to pay off $83,000. Isn't it fun having 7% interest? Isn't interest just fun? Isn't interest just like a great time? Can we all just agree to interest being great? I love interest. It turns all your bad feelings into good hey, feelings. Hey, thank you for the sub. It's a nice... Sean of the Dev, I will now be officially putting that towards the well. <laughs> Is this really the only way to get water to your home? Yeah, it was either that or pay about a quarter of a million to uh, bring up pipe to our house from the city. So, since I didn't want to spend $250,000, and I don't ever have to be, uh, and I don't ever have to be on city water... You know, it was a good, it was a good move. I locked down a 3% interest rate. Yeah, so I have a 3% interest rate on my house, which is smooth bit. It's actually 2.8. Super cool. The other part is getting, uh, you know, so my payment's low. But, uh, yeah, that sucks. Welcome to Costco. All right, well, it's I love in. You. Now, in interest rate is also variable. Yeah, because it's a short-term loan against our house. So we are just going to keep on putting up everything into it. Uh, cause the problem is, is if that you do, if you do like a real refi and you pull something out, the problem is if you pull out money out of a loan and do that, that you have to work through a bank and then you have an origination fee and the origination fee is like, you know, five to $10,000. So it's kind of like, why would I increase the cost by literally Welcome over 10% to, to do that? Right. So I, you know, I'm just going to be, I have some Netflix stock. I will probably end up selling in a while. I'm just waiting for Netflix to go back up and I'll just wait. You know, I'm just going to wait. What's going on in America? I drilled 700 feet into the earth. That's what's going on in America. Okay. 700 feet of steel into the earth to get water to my place. I am getting a hundred gallons per minute though. You know, interest in banks or scams, <laughs> TOS insider trading. <laughs> Hey, no, uh, not user Telkin. Thank you very much for the three months. I saw you. Uh, uh, I saw you do something earlier. I'm trying to remember what you did because I thought it was Tolkien. Appreciate that. Really do appreciate that. Munine, thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime. Uh, 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 by the way, everybody, don't worry. We're gonna be fine. You know, it's gonna take a while, but we're going to get through it. Okay. I don't want you guys to be all weird. I just want to let you know that uh, I appreciate all of you. You guys have been super supportive for the last few months of the stream, and we've been saving up the money to as part of the a way we're gonna pay for this. You know what I mean? Get well soon. Get, hey, hey, yo, kids, get 
afternoon. <laughs> well, it's happening. Luckily, the YouTube channel's pulling in a couple thousand dollars. Uh, my front and masters is pulling in a couple thousand dollars. So all of that's just going to be, you know what I mean? All, all of the side hustle is just going straight into the well. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Live guards, thank you very much. You could take a loan against your Netflix stock. It's all in options. They won't Get do it. The meat. Coding with Lewis, thanks for the five gifted subs. Please, I just got done telling you about an expense. I don't feel like it's right for you guys to give me anything right now. Okay, it feels bad because it feels like I'm asking for money. I'm not asking for money. I've uh, honestly the fact that there's 1900 there's 1900 f people that are here right now blows my mind and I am like so grateful you have no idea. And so I want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. This all just works for uh, yes, it is all just for water. Shut up, KJ. Coding with Lewis, I appreciate it. Oh, coding with Lewis. Hey, coding with Lewis. Coding with Lewis, throw your YouTube channel in the chat right now. I love. I still love. I still love your little Ask tier list. Meat. Oh damn! Let's go, all. DH. Appreciate that. Spot. Okay, Ask guys. I just said. Okay, I'm guys. Give it to me at all. I appreciate it. We can't do that right now. Okay, oh, we cannot oh, do that right now. Flip edits just removed. Ban on DJ. Yeah, get the the hell out of here, DJ. I love you. I'm back. All right. I appreciate it, Namram. Thank you for the well. Okay, guys, stop it. I appreciate it, Lithium. I appreciate Spy for gaming. I appreciate it, uh, DH. I, I can't believe you guys are, you know, you're helping me pay for the well. Thank you. Uh, you know, I'm not going to say that this money is going down the drain. I feel like that was a really good joke. I just didn't know how to finish it off. I didn't know how to finish that dude off. That's the problem. It was like a really great setup, but I just didn't know what to do at the end. You know, I didn't know how to, I didn't know what to do with it. I kind of like, I was flying. It was awesome. And then I just died. I, I didn't know what happened. Thank you, Sly, for the community Welcome stuff. I Costco. genuinely appreciate No I ROM for the well. Thank you. Don't care. Going to help with the well fun. You're awesome. I appreciated it. Gimp, let's go. Gimp, let's go. Uh, RD VR live. Let's go. Hey, Prime Gen, I'm not going to tell you. Uh, let's see. I tell you th Welcome that this money is going down the drain. They you. haven't fixed the drain yet, so that's kind of where we are. Actually, my bathtub isn't fixed. We have to get someone in. It got so much sand in it that, like, I can't even turn on the shower. I go downstairs and I shower in my kid's bathroom. Question is, are you still exclusively peeing outside? I still exclusively pee outside. The UPS man is getting that show every day. Every effing day. Well, that, <laughs> that was well played. <laughs> get out of here thank you uh do that many bits make a make a gigabit i think so thank you chiefs a uh, chief, uh, chief of staffs i appreciate that all right let's keep on going let's find out is this actually doing it keeping it fully hard okay and we're gonna just take this thing go down put it up here i don't know why i did that you know, why did i do that i should have just done this i should have veed welcome to costco uh, veed J I love Boom. You. look at that that was so good and go like this uh promise dot all uh wait promise dot all hit that go down here uh ask them oh my goodness wrong key wrong key gronky isn't there a guy named gronky some like famous fortnite player at least at one point gronky gronky it's Gronky. Hey, I appreciate that. Murph flop. Murph flop. Welcome. I was here during the well arc. You were. Uh, oh my goodness. 500 bennies. Let's go. Is that our well? It is everybody's well. I'll send you some sandy ass water. Jet brains. There is a Gronk. I swear there was like a Gronky. <laughs> I didn't read. Let me know. Merch coming soon. Uh, let them know. Merch. Okay, flip edits. Is merch actually coming, or are you going to keep on hot dogging? Like, what are you going to do? You're going to commit? You're going to get this hot dog out, or are you going to keep on telling me the merch is coming? I've been telling them for three months. I've been telling them since December about this merch. Wait, what am I saying? I, I pitched it in November. When will the well run out of water? It shouldn't. PHP is underrated. Thank you. Please merch. Hey, thank you for Theo. Okay, Theo, you really don't have to do that, Theo. Oh shit. Okay, everyone, stop. Tier three subs from Theo. Everyone, give me go. The meat and give it to me at all. Hey. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Go, go give, go give Theo a follow. You get seventy percent of a tier three gifts, not fifty. Yep. Thank you. Appreciate that. That's called a creator to creator uh, knowledge right there. That was kind of like a little special moment. Appreciate that. Hey, chat, Jippity, thanks for the 6,900 bits. Or the raid. When are you going live? 
when are you going live are you going live soon like i'm I, i'm gonna be finishing up here in a little while i gotta fi i want to see this creator to creator live uh, in a bit have fun nerds okay yeah. yeah 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 thank you i appreciate that i appreciate it just in general yeah theo's going live in 22 hell yeah brother step bro all right, this all right, hold on. Let's get this thing going. Let's get this thing going. Oh my goodness, Chino Maker, thank you for the 10 gifted subs. Holy sh marmalades. Thank you for the 69 biddies. I genuinely appreciate it. Jismal Dev, to be honest, and doing the bare minimum to get on the hype train. Hell yeah, brother. Uh, gonna be a chill stream today. Yeah, I get that. You're a little, you're a little shook. I get it. You're, sh I, hey, we've all been there. Uh, all right, all right, let's do this. Let's get it fully hard. Keeping it fully hard. Okay, let's do that, and then... After we get done doing that, we're going to go like this. Console.log uh, points.map. Uh, there. There we go. Welcome to Costco. I, I love, love you. you. Thank you, X4 Hide. Heed. Hide. I do really appreciate this, guys. Obviously, you just heard me get off the phone, so you you don't even know. This was awesome. You guys just paid, like, literally 1% of the well. Okay, probably not 1% of the well. But either way, 0.5% still 0.5%. Love it. You know, that gets me one step closer. Life is not about getting 10, 20, 30% at a time. It's about that 1% wins, that half percent wins. Get it, baby. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. Um, uh, Marilio. Welcome to Costco. Well, still broken? No. I fixed as of right now. Fixed yesterday. This uh, yesterday evening. Things are going well this stream. They, they're going well this stream. Merlop. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, my nose keeps itching. Okay. That's <laughs> scary. Fuck. Oh, okay. That's <laughs> okay, I'm back. We're back, everybody. I actually, that actually, that actually really got me. Hey, uh, Rob B, thank you very much for that. Wolf, hey, Wolf, Wolfel, thank you for the 20 gifted subs in Crimson. You did not have to do 100. You've already done 100. You don't have to do that. Okay, well, you guys, this is not how money laundering works, okay? This is not how money laundering works, but I appreciate it. Uh, it should have dog earth. Uh, I appreciate that. Uh, uh, Kyoko, thank you, it's Kyoko, for the one gifted sub. Are you guys ready to do this? Are we ready to do this? I'm ready to do this. Again, Crimson Mana, you don't even know how appreciative I have been. Lithium, thank you so much, Wolfie. Oh, man, there's so many people recently. Crimson Mana, uh, you're a well guy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm Welcome convulsing with happiness. Let's get him you. up to 300,000 this year. <laughs> no. No. It doesn't make any sense. Uncle Scientist, I appreciate that. Dude, Abdullah, thank you very much for that brand new Twitch Prime and Coddle Clopper. Thank you for the 69 biddies. Hell yeah, brother. Appreciate Welcome that. Welcome to Costco. All right, guys. I let's do you. this. Let's find out if, if this is actually doing this, okay? Let's find out. Let's find out. So let's jump up here and let's go like this. Const uh, style equals process dot arg v uh, two or um, actually let's go like this. I'm gonna make it a let whatever uh, and do um, eh, we'll do const. We'll do const. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna jump out here and I'm gonna go like this. Okay, oh, dang it! Yeah. <laughs> Definitely evil. That was a very much so appreciated. Kleenex, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Well, I'm a, I'm a well connoisseur. Yeah, if the if the well has rust, is is that a winner? No. It are are so that there's so much to a well. There's also tanks. You have to keep up the pressure from the well. So our tanks had uh um rust in them. So we actually had to replace our 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 pump and our pressure tanks and all that shit. It was it was very annoying. How does this clown? Uh, have 2,000 viewers. Easy. By banning people. Just like that. Clown. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Like that, Karen. Okay. See what, I, see what I'm saying, Karen? Here's the deal, Karen. You can't ask questions. Okay, because when you ask a question, you might find out that it's a joke or something good. Then you're going to feel bad. So instead, you just blindly kick ass and take names. That's what I do, Karen. And then afterwards, when people tell me that they were talking about someone completely different, and then I feel bad, I can feel bad by myself. You know what I'm talking about? Just like yesterday, Karen. Pew! This clown has 2K view because he's blazingly amazing. Hey, thank you. I appreciate that. Let's go, people. Let's go. Thank you for all of that, dude. Again, uh, definitely evil. Thank you for that. Dunna, uh, Dunna Dank. 
Let's go. All right. Are you ready to do this, people? I'm ready. All right. So we have this one. Let's go like this. Ooh, I like this song. I'm going to turn it up. It for me, at least. Uh, let's go like this. Style equals one. Hell yeah, girl. Uh, let's go like that. Strat. There we go. And we're just going to count and do all those things. He, yes. All right. So now that we have that, we're going to take this. We're going to restart our data serve just in case something's going crazy on this one. We're going to build this. This is going to run strategy one, if I'm not mistaken. We're going to run strategy one and see what it takes to do effectively 10,000 events. Oh, we have the debugger going. We can't have that one. So let's all go like that. Bad, dad, boo, got you, dad. Thank you very much for the 1,000 biddies intrinsic talks. Thank you very much. Look at that. L hell yeah. I want you, Elefante. Okay, so this is about what it took. Oh, look at that. Starts off fast, and it just slows down. That thing grinded to a halt. So let's actually uh, let's uh, forget this one. Let's go like this. Let's go to 20. Let's go to uh, 50. I feel like we got to go 50. Let's go 50 on this SOB because something seems a little goofy there. Also, another thing we should be doing, we should be minimizing or minifying our code because I don't know if you know this, but uh, optimization of code is totally based on code length and function size. So it is always good to do that. So another reason why you should avoid um, code like this it's functional, bro. The problem with code like this is that it's not small. So this code to get optimized is actually going to take quite a few runs before it does it. You know what I mean? Hey, Welcome to Costco. I appreciate that again. I Count a Geiger coming in with a thousand biddies. Damn. And JS. Okay, guys, I really do appreciate it. You know I do. You know I do. But I feel genuinely bad because, you know, I got done telling you about a problem in my life and then you guys are Welcome uh, to Costco. jumping on here. It, it, I love you. I genuinely have appreciated every moment of support, every inch of your support you've given me. Thank you. You have been an inspiration for me uh, for uh, for so long. Keep it up, Chan. Thank you. Thank you. They've heard about... Uh, okay, look at this. Oh, wait. This makes perfect sense. Of course it's going up constantly. It's uh, This is just about how long it took. Okay. Okay. What am I saying? I'm a dumb dumb. I'm literally a dumb person. I'm an actual dummy. I'm like an actual dumb dumb for not realizing that was happening. You know what I mean? Uh, is there a tutorial by him on how to use this keyboard? Yeah, you put your hands on the keyboard and you start typing. And if you're not good at it, you keep at it and you try to memorize it without looking at it. Tutorial over. Peace, bitches. All right, it's like that simple. Uh, Brian, let cool people be cool. It's okay. What, what are they doing? What's the cool people being? We're paying our JavaScript taxes. Damn, is this one just slower in all regards? Damn, this one could just simply be slower in all regards and uses more memory. <sighs> That's confusing to me. It certainly spends a lot less time. Man, it's slower in all things. Okay. Okay. We know what happens here. Interesting. I just would not have, I guess I would not have guessed this. I mean, this is a good reason why you should look at things, right? One reason why I wouldn't have guessed that is just because, like, you know, things like this, right? You're, like, growing an array over time, which is, like, reallocation over and over and over again. Whereas this one is just, like, a one-time allocation deal. Maybe a megabyte's too big, but I just somehow doubt that. I'm just curious, why isn't it cleaning up? I thought that would do a little bit better. I was, you know, curious about this whole writing into boo for business. Maybe that's just what, really? I was listening to the music, dog. Huh. No, I'm not going to write a book. I'm not like a book guy. Uh, on the smartphone, uh, the Prime is uh, plus five euros. Wait, what? What? Are you ever going to? I'm never going to write a book. This is because V8 is smarter than us. V8 is always smarter than you. It, per it is permanently smarter than you. Well, damn. Okay, well, that's cool to know. I mean, it's good to know. I, I thought this might actually do something here, but it didn't do anything. Which is kind of sad. You know what I mean? Because the deal is like protobuffs aren't going to win. They're not going to win. This code I hate. But they both have the same shitty code. So it's not like there's anything special going on. I wonder, you know, this should, this should obviously never do anything important. Right? That should never do anything important here. Right? Uh... 
It just prevents reallocation. It shouldn't do anything. Uh, recap. We're going to do a recap. We're going to do a recap here in just one second. Still returning uh, in the loop. We're still returning in the loop. What do you mean, returning in the loop? Which which loop? We are doing a try catch, which totally sucks, but whatever. You can't, I mean, it's like you can't really get out of that, huh? What do you mean? Uh, started using Zed yesterday. Uh, very fun to use. The only problem is no PHP support. Yeah, there's like n not a lot of other supports, too. I always figured that that would do a lot just because you have to allocate so many things. Who would have guessed that this thing was that much slower? Okay, it's good to know. It uses more memory. I mean, this is why you do experiments, right? The reason why you do experiments is that you got to know what's slow. You know what I mean? And if you don't know what's slow, you don't even know why you're doing it. Uh, we could we could do some profiling and find out. I'd like to get a flame graph more than anything else. Interesting, interesting. We are probably going to need to do even more of these tests because you know the one of the problem with these tests is that we don't even know. Like even this right here is not showing. It's not very good. It's not a good conclusive evidence that this is that much slower. It looks like this one is about. I mean, at least with every one of these points, it's like 100 milliseconds slower every single time. This one, on, though, now that it's been running a little bit, is less slow. Interesting. Huh. What happened if we do this? Let's start a fresh data serve. And let's do this once. Welcome to Costco. I, I love, love you. you. Hey, Wilkie, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Smurf Shaker. Welcome let's do to that. Costco. I'm going to do one more little test. Smurf you. Shaker with a brand new tier one. Hell yeah, brother. What's wrong with try catch? I think it, I, I know it used to do it. It doesn't do it anymore. But every time I see that, you can't really optimize if you don't experiment right. Exactly. Aren't you double boofing with your git line? Am I double boofing with my git line? Am I is that what's happening? No. Wait, what? No. 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 No no double. Yeah, I'm going to check the encode function. I I do want to get like a little uh I want to let's see. I've been watching for some uh, months already. I just love the content, the passion you give everybody, and the energy. Some bits for you to stay hydrated. Appreciate the 600 biddies, baby. Let's go. Is the testing done on a, a Linode machine? No. So that is one thing that would make it better is avoiding, uh, avoiding any discrepancies like this. I also feel like my, my server, I should probably write my, my other server in Rust and just make that one as fast as possible so there is no hindrance between the two. Because what I want to make sure is that my Welcome other one Costco. isn't getting all effed up. You know what I mean? Because you don't want to be hitting like some bad cycles or whatever is happening, right? It, it would suck. I wonder if I manually call GC, even though it will be a lot slower. I wonder if that is actually better. Just a thought, right? Just a thought. Always call GC. Maybe I can always make. I can just make it run lower every single time. That could be an. Uh, that could be an alternative. You know what I mean? Damn it, I'm going to have to do real science now. I got the same answer now. But, I mean, obviously the, the math isn't that good. The the, the memory usage kind of sucks. Uh, let's go like this. Let's, okay, let's go like this. Let's do one more thing. Let's go like this. Uh, let uh, run count equals zero. Let's go down. Let's go down to this thing. All right, so now that we've done that, let's go run count equals zero. And every time we produce, uh, let's see, run count plus plus. Uh, if a uh, run count is greater, let's see, uh, modulo every 10,000 objects, every, uh, let's go every 500 objects, start small. Can we do like some sort of exposing GC process dot GC? Isn't there like uh, expose GC node. There's some way to explode that. What is it? Hmm. Set flags.
Whoopsies. There we go. We got ex oh, there we go. We got the the GC exposed. Expose that SOB GC. And so I'm now I'm curious, can we keep down the memory? Cuz right now my memory is very very important. And so I'm just going to have this thing run constantly, right? And we'll do this. And so this thing should hopefully keep driving it downwards. Because when you manually call GC, you are also manually calling a large garbage collection event. Which 500 should happen pretty frequently. Oh, I did this. It should be happening nonstop. That's, that's not good. It doesn't look like it's doing anything. Again, manual memory, ma manual memory, ma manual memory management is hard. Are we exploring GC? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, interesting. I might actually miss it every now and then. Not that we've ever had it run like this. I guess I should probably do that. We could technically miss it. You know what I mean? We could miss it every now and then. Encode function returns on the first iteration of the loop inside of it. The encode function. How did I do that? Oh, no. This, this has to be way worse then. Well, now I'm now now you got me real curious. So when did I do that? All right. Well, there's no way that that's gonna be very good. There's no way that that's gonna go the way you want it to go. There's no way that's gonna work out. No such file or directory called it. Yep. Yeah, it happens. What in tarnations? What? Uh, let's see. What font? I have no idea what font it is. Yo, Prime Gen, first time on the stream, and I saw you on uh, YouTube uh, in a boot camp, and today I had to show off our uh, week-long solo projects, and I bombed hard. People said, why? Why'd you bomb hard? Notice me? I've noticed you. Well, I don't want some... I don't... Ooh. All right. Let me whisper him. I'll whisper Casey this one. See if he wants to do this. Classic, it runs faster when you do more work. Don't you love JavaScript? Don't you just love JavaScript? This is the fastest run we've ever had. And it just happens to be the one where I stopped returning in the middle of a loop on accident. Isn't that just beautiful? Classic JS. Oh, now we're guaranteed to run longer. Okay, so there's going to be one more thing I'm going to do. I, I want to do a. I want to do a repeatable... Uh, thing right here. So right now I'm doing right res this thing and we're gonna go like this create event this so instead of doing a random I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna go uh, ID this uh, keys dot length, right? There we go. So now it's repeatable, right? Every single time you ask for a message, it's identical among everybody. So there's no more uh, chaos involved or no more because that's one of the problems. You can never chaos these things. And let's uh, let's go uh, TSC uh, end node dist uh, dist uh, data. There we go. Let's make it fast. Let's make it smooth. There we go. It's running just the best version of ourselves as possible. And then let's do this one. So we're going to always have the exact same results. So let's first start with this one more time. It's still using a lot of memory. I have so much questions about this. All right, let's find out why it's using all this memory. Why are we using so much memory? I must be accidentally doing something. So let's find out really quickly. After it runs with this thing. One last time. JavaScript boilerplate. Okay, again, like literally the fastest run we've had yet. I don't know how in the heavens that is even possible. 
How in the world are we getting faster runs and the only thing we've done is added more code? What the hell happens with JavaScript? This is why JavaScript is like the impossible language to, to make faster. It is the, it's so hard. It's uh, warming up. It's warming up. It ran that function like 50,000 times. What do you mean it's warming up? Welcome to Costco. I love you. All right, let's do this. And then we're going to go back to the other one. We're going to find out. Uh... Okay, now this one's significantly slower. Okay, we need that. We need to go run this. We need to. I damn it! I need to go run this like nine thousand times. Why is this useful? But the bigger question I need to answer myself right now is this. Um, let's go into here and let's go up here and where are you? Let's take this one and say should report. Let's do this one and go there and go uh, false. Go there. Boom, 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 boom. All right. <laughs> All right. So there we go. So should we report? Yeah, 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 yeah. So we're going to go like this. Ingest to uh, ingest. Go like this. Uh, inspect. Make this happen. So now that we have that, we're going to jump in here. Close as flashbang. Jump this thing open. Bring it over. Memory. And we're going to start. Not snapshot. Allocation instrument. Uh, allocation sampling. Let's go. Tell me, where is this memory being spent? All right, so there we go. We're going to look at this. Memory is going nuts. We are megabytes at a time. Megabits, megabots, mega holy shits going on. He GC'd strategy one, but it's running uh, strategy two. Yeah, I'm doing strategy two right. I mean, so I did this one. Strategy two somehow is now vastly faster than strategy one, right? This is, by the way, this is another reason why whenever you see... How, wait. Oh, I, I, I just killed our poor little, our poor little, uh, data server. There we go. Oh, two. <laughs> I'm so stupid. All right. There we go. We'll keep doing this until we get a little bit higher. Pick, what the hell are you saying, Pick? Uh, why does uh, why does the directory say Netflix? Does he work at Netflix? No. No porque, Maria. All right, so here we go. So we're going, we're running, we're looking good, we're moving fast. Where is all this memory being allocated from? Let's find out. Subarray, huh? Okay, okay. Okay, that's not it. That's not the problem here. That's not the problem here. That is not our problem right now. That is not our problem right now. That is not our problem. What up, Rockstar3000? Socket boof it. So a socket boofer. So something is holding on to some memory. So, okay, let's see. There we go. We're going up. All right, so let's go like that. Let's take another one. Now, can't you, uh, where's the compare? All right, uh, where, where is all of our memories at? 
Is this where it's all at? I mean, we have five mega bees in here. That's fine. That's kind of what I would expect five mega bees. Right? I'd expect that. Right? Okay, nine, nine megabytes seems a little high. Right? There should only be... Uh, Yeah, seven should be like what it's at. There should be seven. There's there's like nine now. Okay, that's remaining the same. So these are remaining the same. Okay. Okay, so those are remaining the same. Compiled code has just gotten so effing annoyingly large. Hold on. But compiled code's all the same thing. Okay, so compiled code is all just all the same memory. The strings are all the same memory. Everything is pretty much staying the same memory, huh? Well, then who the hell's using all this this memory? This is probably... Is this all just pointing at the same array buffers underneath the hood? Something is telling me. System SME. Is he working on Netflix or just JK? I'm working on, I, I am working on things that involve Netflix. What I'm trying to figure out about Netflix. Because my problem is, is that I have a memory problem. How do you do a comparison? Select comparison and go, it'll automatically do the one before it. There's a new Casey video. Yeah, 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 yeah. Casey's a good guy. All right, let's try this again. Who is causing all the memory? Who is causing all the memory? I was thinking that, let's see, when they say it's a Zoom meeting with the colleagues, they should watch in on slow-mo uh, after the call and figure out Welcome what the meeting was about. I love you. What? All in winter, what are you talking about? S. Lurk, S. Lurk, uh, 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 Sleekirk, Sleeklerk. Didn't use Rust. I also have memory problems. I always forget uh, my things. Yeah, would be cool to t uh, talk to someone who knows V8 on stream. Yeah, I, I could get uh, Lexi on here, my coworker. He helped develop V8. Uh, he's actually watching Netflix on the other side. Classic. All right. All right, so... You can tell... Obviously, you can tell that this is not even remotely correct, right? Um, so where... where next tick is doing a shockingly large amount. How much do you want to bet... Readable chunk. Okay, so this is all in HTTP. This is all HTTP. I need a better, see, I need a gosh dang better server, readable state. Okay, so this is all just stuff I can't really control, right? I might be able to control this, right? That's probably my only thing I can control. The rest is just like uncontrollable, which is a little frustrating. Because then here's like me, right? Keeping it hard, a lot, lot of the, some time spent in promises. So pro promises could, you know, I could stop with the promises. Ah, oh, it's so annoying. Okay, a lot of time spent in promises. So it might be better to avoid promises, but that's kind of a crappy, you know, kind of sucks. I don't really want to avoid promises. I feel like... I feel like I need to look at different HTTP models. Promises are worth, uh, to be honest. Refactor to go, how much uh, do you trust the output if it's so much different than what you see on the console? I don't know. Can you, Do you ever know? I don't even know. That's the problem. Two, trois. All right. Frustrating. Frustrating. I'm going to go find, I mean, because faster, I honestly don't care about faster. Speed is not my problem. I need memory reduction. I guess my next thing I should try is deleting of properties. I'm always curious how that works. Is deleting of properties worth it? Oh, I guess one thing I didn't look at is this. Oh, actually, let's let's add in a let's add in a um, let's see. Uh, let's go like this. Let's see. Uh, let's go like this. If this thing equals false or uh, process, uh, let's see, arg v3 equals undefined. 
gosh, I hate logic sometimes. <laughs> I hate I hate logicking. Okay, oh, hey, nice. That's where I would have put it too. Um, G, uh, should GC right? That's where I would have put it. There we go. Should report. Wait, yeah, yeah. Oh gosh, I have that so backwards. It's like driving me nuts. I hate this. I hate what I'm looking at. I hate what I'm looking at. I guess here, let's just keep it simple. I'm gonna go like this, true. Only if you provide true should we report. So it doesn't matter what else you say, unless if it's true, it doesn't do it. Okay, so let's do a GC, GC this, uh, should GC, there we go. So let's do this thing. It's just gonna run it. And so now we're gonna go like this, whoopsies. This should, Oh, crash. Wrong one. What, what am I doing? Where's my... V yeah, that's what I was looking for. So this thing is having no GC running. Get uh, Bozo. Uh, get, get, get gone. Link or get uh, link or get banned. I was debugging a memory leak in PHP. Link or get banned? Comes in here and just telling us how to run a stream? What? No, you don't come in here and tell me how to run my stream, bozo. So that's what I said to him, and then flip banned him. It was super cool, Karen. It was like oh, practically like an old what? What? You can't. Old westerns don't count. What, Karen? Why you gotta be? Why you? You really, you're really raining on my parade right now, Karen. All right, so that's what we're doing. Okay, uh, one false true. Wait, why? Why are you? I don't want that. Uh, TSC. Uh, one false true. All right, so now we should be running GC. Stop creeping up. Go back down, boys. I mean, it looks smaller. This might be my move. I mean, I could just I could just expose GC and call it more often. I don't like that it's still going up. Am I leaking something somewhere? It just didn't show up. And doesn't it look like I'm leaking? Am I leaking? Hey, at least I'm not leaking as much as Cam was leaking gear to the lobby last night. Am I right, Peck? There we go. All right, we're going to raid Theo. Everybody, his cat is experiencing some sicknesses, and he was, you know, he's in a tough spot right now. So everybody go over there and cheer him up, okay? Give him some cheers, okay? Give him some cheers. Does the UPS guy watch you leak on stream? Yeah. Yeah. Theo raid? Yeah, we're going to do it. Oh, yes, it's happening. Cool stream prime. Thank you. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm happy with the results. Right? Because it's something that's really important to me right now is just figuring out how to lower memory. This makes me, I, I swear I have a memory leak. I don't know where the memory leak is. I just, I am completely convinced it's with the stupid idea of writing class, uh, functions. I think it's, I'm just doing something dumb right in there. I, I just, it's so easy to mismanage your memory when you use, use some of these things. JavaScript is not a place to mess around with. I'm too dumb to be right to like be tricky. This is so sus. Like, look at it. It's dude, look how sus that is. Look at how sus that is. Look at how sus that is. 
I don't like it. Ooh, wait, am I, wait, did I, oh, I ran it with inspect on. Oh, I wonder if you're right. Oh, I wonder if you're right. Sorry, you guys are all about to probably not even see the results of this. 